And welcome everyone to this week's episode of Omega Dawn, our Star Frontiers Alpha Hawks uh, campaign. Um, when we left the intrepid budget crew last time, they had just gone through a um, battle in space against a bunch of pirates um, and uh, the fleet or task force, if, if you prefer, that they were part of lost a couple of ships. Um, the Clarion Marines have uh, lost their uh, uh, frigate, I think it was, um, and one of the assault scouts. Uh, so there's only two assault scouts left. Um, but um, you also did find evidence uh, in the wreckage of the pirate base uh, that the uh, Streel Corporation had been financing the pirates. Uh, when this evidence was brought back to Clarion, the um, uh, Streel was in a lot of trouble. <laughs> Um, and uh, while it's going to take several years to work its way through the courts, um, eventually what happened, or will happen, as the case may be, uh, is that Streel is fined an incredible amount of money, uh, basically um, in damages and um, all sorts of other uh, punishment, financial punishments. Um, so uh, the two surviving crews... Uh, of the Marines um, are uh, uh, hel uh, wel uh, welcome back as uh, um, heroes, although it's a very somber welcome, as you can imagine, having lost um, the fleet flagship as well as another assault scout. Um, the Marines go on a massive recruiting drive amongst other, other uh, planetary militias and also the Starfleet. Uh, the space fleet, I should say. Um, and also over the course of several months, managed to organise the borrowing slash leasing slash advanced, um, advanced delivery of um, another frigate and two more um, assault scouts to bring the fleet up to um, one frigate. I think it's a frigate, yeah, um, and uh, and four assault scouts. But that takes, as I said, several months to organise and take delivery of and bring in the crews and and everything else like under that. Um, if I hadn't if I haven't mentioned it already, uh, everybody's been promoted to junior lieutenant uh, for for their sterling work. Mm -hmm. So congratulations on that. And. Um, during that couple of months period, life settles back down pretty much into um, a, a regular, uh, your regular routine. Although it is a bit cramped uh, to start with, with only two assault scouts, um, you're put through a pretty high tempo of inspections and um, patrols while that's all going on. Once the uh, the first of the uh, replacement um, assault scouts arrives, um, and with um, as new crew uh, and members of the Marines are um, are recruited in, um, you guys are given a bit of a uh, the tempo drops back drops drops back a bit. So um, so that's what happens over over the course of six to eight months or so um, during that during that build up uh, period. Um, so yeah, it was a great tragedy um, losing so many experienced officers and crew members on the uh, on the frigate. And the other assault scout, but uh, but yes. So um, no, you're no longer the most experienced um, engineer. Folks. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> so yeah, so a lot of new faces. Assault scout engineer. Uh, that's true. Um, a lot of a lot of new faces. A lot of getting to know um, know your the, the new marines. Um, they're not all newbies, obviously. Some of them, as because some of them have been uh, recruited or even seconded. From um, from stuff uh, from space fleet, there's a lot of experience amongst them, um, so uh, things gel pretty well. Um, although you know it takes a while, it does take you know, several weeks for it to to all to all gel in. Um, has anyone got any questions about all that or comments? How much more money are we making now that we got a promotion? Yeah, you took uh, out of my mouth. Give <laughs> me the money. You lot are bloody mercenaries. Um, I'll have to work. I'll have to work it out. Um, 
yeah, I haven't, I haven't got it in front of me. Sorry. I, I should have done. I should have realized you'd ask something like that. Why am I not surprised? Or why am I surprised, I should say. Uh, so, yeah. Anyway, about six months or so after the, um, after the, um, the battle, um, as I said, the, the, other, uh, the other assault scouts are starting to arrive. Um, you're on, you guys are out on one of your regular patrols. Um, um, you're, uh, you're approaching a, um, 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 a freighter, large freighter, um, as you have done many times in the past. Um, so, um, during your normal, during the normal heads up call that Lieutenant Taby, sorry, <coughs> that's nice. Uh, Lieutenant Taby gives you, he, um, um, he says, he, his voice comes out of the intercom to you. We're about 30 minutes out, guys. And girls, sorry, I keep forgetting cat. Um, where uh, HQ has given me very strict instructions for dealing with this particular freighter. She's carrying a very important cargo, apparently. Um, so uh, we'll actually be docking, docking, as opposed to going over via um, spa uh, 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 spacesuit. Um, you do that roughly half the time, by the way, just as a as a feeling. Um, so um, so you won't be. Uh, so you'll be. Yeah. So report down to the um, uh, the storage deck, um, and be ready to carry out your duties, ladies and gentlemen. TV out. All right, I think we head down there. I'm... You, everyone carrying their standard kit, I take it? Yeah. Yep. All right. Okay. Um, there's um, a soft clunk as the two ships lock together. Um, again, pretty standard stuff. Um, I just need to check something. Won't be a tick. Should have realized. And also when you get yep. the chance if Lieutenant Tabby can tell us exactly what the orders from HQ were. Why it's um, so important. Yeah. Uh, he doesn't reply when you uh, when you put that through. He's probably um, too busy piloting the piloting the ship in to, to dock properly. Um, so he'll probably get back to you about that one. And then we um, dock and we open the thing and lasers start blasting and then it's too late for that. I thought I was the GM. I thought I was the GM running this game. <laughs> very cynical, my boy. Very, very cynical. Well, you can very disprove cynical. me then. Hey? You can prove me wrong then. All right, I'll prove you wrong. Um, the doors open up um, and um, you see a party of Sapphire coming through and they shoot frag grenades at you. Not lasers. So to you, actually, they do, actually, they, actually, they're dose grenades. Um, two dose grenades come flying into the um, flying through the airlock, uh, open opening door, um, and land amongst you. I need you all to make um, uh, two stamina checks, two current stamina checks, not to fall unconscious, unless we have things that wake us up automatically. I'm serious, guys. Why'd you roll twice, Therese? Didn't you say make two checks? Oh, I did too. Sorry. Yes. Thank you. My fault. Which is good because I think my body comp only wakes me up once. Yep. It only has one room. It were room for one patch. Uh, so another one from Doc. And another, oh, no. Yes. The second one for Doc. And another one from you, Babu, please. 
Looks like Vote goes unconscious. Yeah, I assume that I do have the body comp with the thing, but since I failed twice. Yeah, you failed twice, yeah. Uh, Doc, do you, have, do you have the body comp that wakes you up, Doc? No, I'm asleep. You're asleep, so Vote's asleep, Doc's asleep. Cerise is Babu's okay because you. Babu's asleep. You, you, don't have, you don't have the body comp either, um, Babu. Nope. Okay. So it's Cerise and Cat, looks like. Is that right? Uh, yep. Right. Well, if you check the combat tracker. And if you That's could, not could good. Me, yeah, if you two could roll me issues, please. So, 10 and 11, is that right? Or are you awake, Spobu? No, you're not, you're not. Yeah, that's right, I'm not. Okay, it's got a 10. Cerise has got an 11 and the Sapphire. So you said you wanted Sapphire, by the way, uh, Dan. And I told him before it's the game started Sapphire. that we're going to kill some Sathar tonight. <laughs> See, I was I was right one time and I was half right another time. Oh, well, aren't you clever? Okay, Cerise, you got first. You got first dibs at the moment. Um, although you can see, uh, you can see a bunch of South R. You've only really got target on South R A and B. You're there in front. Uh, they're armed with grenade launchers, um, and they've also got um, looks like albedo screens. Can I? I assume we're on our side of the airlock, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. The, yeah. yeah. The um, the 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 uh, decks about um. 10 meters, uh, sorry, uh, yeah, about 10 meters by six, um, but it's but the corners are cut out, so it's an oct it's a flattened octagon shape. Yeah, so I, I want to get to a shout out South Sathar over the comm systems, and I'm going to try to my my first thing is to close the portal. The try airlock. close the portal. Yeah, okay. if I can do something more than that, I'll throw a grenade at him, but I don't think I can. Well, um, the airlock's the, air, the, the airlock's controlled electronically, so it's either getting to the panel or you can throw the grenade. It's your choice. No, so if, you're gonna, if you are going to if you are going to throw the grenade, it's going to do a lot of damage because it's a very confined space to them. Yeah, I don't have a frag grenade. I don't. That's oh. not my normal kit. Fair enough. Okay. Um, well, let's. Uh, um, you are not successful in closing the uh, the airlock door, unfortunately. Uh, not before they not before they get uh, they get into the gap, and the safety protocols won't let the door be closed on a living being. So, okay, okay, all right, cat. All right, uh, I would grab a, a stim dose patch and slap it on Babu and right. hope, take some cover. Okay, uh, well, this, there, yeah, there's some cover. There's boxes, it's, it's a storage area, so so yeah, you can take some cover. Um, Babu, stim dose patch. Um, right. Okay, so these guys can't do anything. Because they can't get anywhere at the moment, so they're going on here. Um, okay, so um, Sathar A, who happens to be closest to you, Cerise, um, slings his rifle, sort more or less, and uh, draws a vibro knife and has a slash at you with he with his vibro knife and misses. Uh, 
B's reloading with um, another grenade. Uh, so uh, let's get some initiative rolls for the next round, please. And you too, Babu, because that should wake you up, I believe. So Babs is on a nine. Cerise is on a 12. And Kat's still on a 10. Okay. Yeah, well, it won't change the order as such. All right, Cerise. You've got a sapphire in front of you with a vibra knife. All right. Can I uh, activate my force axe and take a swing? Sure. Wow, that's a really good swing. Does it do double damage? Nope. But it does knock him out. Which is probably a good thing. Cat? All right. Uh, does, is there one in front of me? Oh, this one, well, not, not, not melee-wise, but you certainly could get in the melee if you wanted to, or you could shoot something if you wanted to shoot something. You could throw something if you had a grenade to throw, for example. Hmm. Trying to, try, trying to get a picture of whether it would be better for me to engage with something with a sonic sword or do a burst with my auto pistol. Um, the only problem with doing a burst is Cerise is too close, I think. Yeah, it always, it always happens. Uh, well, so people going to melee. So I guess I am getting out my sonic sword. And attacking? Uh, well, one just fell out in front of Ceri, so whichever one's closest. Oh, that would be B. Uh, if if I can see one that's reloading a grenade, definitely that one. Yeah, that'd be B, yeah. Yeah, all right. That's a hit. Nice one, too. Okay. 26 points damage. He's heavily wounded. He's old Sapphire B. Babu, um, you uh, find yourself um, confronted with a bunch of Sapphire. Cool. How many can I hit? <laughs> one. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, cats just take cats just sh um just uh, heavily wounded Sapphire B. Uh, Sapphire C is also uh, moving forward. Sapphire C is aimed with a laser rifle um, and has a, and also has a gyro jet pistol on on his uh, belt on uh, his belt on his waist. I will move towards C and slap him with my force axe. Slap him with your force axe. I see. You. Wow, another good hit. 34 points of damage. He's heavily wounded. Okay, so South RC um, wasn't expecting that so much, so he's going to swing his rifle butt at your head. Oh, and connects. Uh, for f 18 points of damage. To Babu? To Babu. Yeah, sorry, to Babu. 18? 18, 18 one With eight. a... What are you hitting uh, me with? A rifle butt, with a club, basically. Okay, so my inertial screen will... No, I have a beta screen. I have the uh, skin suit. Yeah, the skin suit will take half we'll of take that. take half of that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, D does manage to slither past um, and get into get into the Osprey. Uh, e is, doesn't have a chance yet. Um, so B, who was fighting Cat, 
Uh, also uh, draws a, a vibro knife and has a swing at you, Cat. Uh, that's a hit. Yes, it is. Uh, vibro knife, 2d10. Uh, yeah, I think so. Oh, hang on, I made a mistake. That's sorry, not fifth, not what did I say? Um, not 19 points. Sorry, um, Babu, 12 points. Oh, okay. So, 60 or 60 to the suit. That was a mistake on my part. Sorry about that. Uh, the vibro knife only does eight points of you, eight points to you, um, cat. Skin suit helps. Yep. Okay. Uh, next round, round three. Nice roll, Babs. Well, wow, very nice roll, Babs. I don't like getting slapped. Funny that. Uh, Therese is on 12. And Babu's on 15. Where are you, Babu? There you are. Okay, so on. And the Sathar. God, can I roll any worse? Hey! Babu! C still up, right? C still up, but heavily wounded. Uh, D still D D circling around to, uh, behind you, by the way. Oh, D is circling behind me. Mm-hmm. C is heavily wounded. Mm-hmm. I'll take a swipe at uh, D then. Okay. That's a hint. Uh huh. D's heavily wounded. Uh, Cerise, you are unengaged. Technically unengaged, although, um, although uh, E uh, E is fast approaching. Is there? Um, can I can I get three or more with a tangler grenade? Yes, you can. Yeah, uh, you got G H um, and F are all back far enough. If you, as long as you don't stuff up your roll. Oh, I'll step up the roll, but, you know, <laughs> it's a grenade attack. All right, throwing weapons. Daddy yep. short range. All right, it's a miss. D8 for direction and D5 for distance. This could end up anywhere. I'm having trouble grabbing the D8. Long and to the, long and to the left, which is in, yeah. Uh, bounce, uh, okay, bounce back. It's going to bounce back. That's uh, the one D5. Thing. Yes. Yeah. Just roll D10 and divide by two. Or oh, there's, there's a D5 on the D10, by the way. Somewhere. Well, it was. Oh, it's not there, not there anymore. No, it must, it must be on the other one. Don't ignore that. That was me playing around. Um, right, Tangler Grenade. Um, okay, well, the um, uh, F, G, and H are all um, are all um, entangled in a Tangler Grenade, which is uh, good news for you guys. Cat. All right, may as well swing again at B. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah, still a hit. I'm serious. I'm seriously impressed, dude. Uh, okay, B goes down. Nice. 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 B, 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 B. Hang on. Let me, let me adjust. Yeah, maybe goes down. Uh, now, C was fighting uh, Babu and technically has flank at the moment. Not that it's going to make a big difference. Uh, that's... Yeah, that's a hit. Um, for 10 points of uh, bludgeoning damage, Babu. 
Ten points, you said? Yeah, ten. Uh, D also swings at you, uh, but misses. And E moves up to engage Cerise. Um, and has his gu- and has changed his laser rifle for his guard jet pistol, which means he's going to take three shots at you, Cerise. One. Actually, only two, because he had to draw it. Oh, wow. That's not good. Two. Okay. The second shot misses. The first shot hits um but hits his own guys <laughs> perfect no not perfect not perfect at all uh pistols are two Oh, pistols are two. Two, oh, I'll, two I'll, dice I'll, of damage. i'll forget the I'll, I'll forget the last one then oh that's that's good it keeps him alive <laughs> Uh, so D takes that in the head. So a Gorajet a Gorajet round flies past your head, Babu, and strikes D in the face. <clears throat> oh man, that's a shame. That's a shame. Uh, F, H, and G are all tangled. Hang on, tangled, tangled. Got to make these notes, otherwise I'll get all this track of it. Tangled. So that's F. And G, that's everybody then. Um, in which case, um, I'll get some initiatives off everybody, please. For round four. We need Therese to get some more stimulus. I starting to get confused about them going around him now. Yeah, you got one on either side, dude. Uh, Cat? Thank you. That was weird. Yeah. Uh, you're up, Cat. You're not engaged. Um, so here's the situation. Um, C and D are both on Babu, both heavily wounded. E is on Cerise, unwounded at all, and you are unengaged, and the other three are either, and, uh, are either tangled or dead or unconscious. The other five are tangled, dead or unconscious. Okay. Uh, well, I will probably turn around and engage one that is... Uh, engage with Babu, so he doesn't have and to we'll fight. He's probably the closest in that regard. Yep. Another nice hit. And C goes down. Excellent. It might help if I rolled an issue for them too, actually. Hang on, I forgot to do that. Oh, that's not good. Uh, yes, it is because it means C gets to go beforehand because I just rolled a I just rolled a nice and high one. Actually, C goes simultaneously. C goes no, it goes before actually. All right, so sorry, I got to I got to do C's. Oops, that was only one. It should have been two. Uh, yeah, that's a hit. Um, that's. Um, I can't find what I'm looking for. Uh, that's eight points of damage, Babu. Bludgeoning damage. Uh, and a further uh, a further four points of bludgeoning damage from D. Cat takes out C. And so, at the same time, E um, shoots at Cerise again. One, two. I don't know why I bother. I can't hit. I can't hit for shit. Uh, Cerise. Can I stem those, Volk? Uh, yeah, you'll probably get kicked in the guts by a sapphire at the time. That's okay. Okay. You can stim those folk, yes. Uh, and the sapphire miss, sapphire misses you with his opportunity shot. Uh, Babu. 
you're facing D. D. Got it. Hug me. He's dead. Oh, don't even have to roll damage. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> nope. You don't have to roll damage. Um. Oh. I'll, 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 yeah, I'll Doc's name. Hey, Doc. Got some uh, cuts, bru bruises over here. Yeah, I think Doc's dead. Uh, He's initial, still asleep. Please. Yeah, Doc's still asleep. So, Vokes on 14. Cerise is on 7. I think we need to murder all these helpless, incapacitated Sather. Uh, <laughs> we just try to keep... Well, the, the we can get a fortune for bringing them in alive. I'm not, we have got to bring them in unconscious. Yeah, unconscious and alive. Yeah, the ones in the Tangler grenades we kill. Um, blow themselves up. Yeah. Um, Babu, can I get an issue off you, please? But the one that got knocked out from the critical hit, we can take. We can try. Yeah. Okay. Now, this is going to be interesting. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. So, Babu and Cat and Vogue all go at the same time. What are you all doing? I stand up. Get my sonic sword out and activate my shield, my screen. Right. Cat? I'd be trying to cut down one that is tangled. All right. And Babu? So they're all down or entangled, right? No. Safari still engaged with Cerise. Safari? Mm hmm. Oh, I must get to her aid and hit him. Okay. Oh, uh, between the two of you. Oh, hang on. Oh, yeah. Okay, so you've wounded one. You've wounded one of the tangled, tangled grenade one. Let's say F. Let's say F. Yep. Um, can't. You actually didn't need to uh, roll. Oh, you didn't need to roll. You could have hit the bulkhead. Um, uh, that's on. <laughs> okay. So E's still up but heavily wounded. F is uh, trapped but heavily wounded. G and H are trapped. Um, and A is wounded and unconscious. Okay, so Cerise, you have got next action. So B, C, and D are dead? B, C, and D are lying on the ground leaking green fluid. And A is the one I knocked unconscious. So can I get yeah. to the, I think you said E was still free? Yeah, E's still free and engaged with you and now Babu. Okay, then I'll attack him. Okay. Oh, it, it seemed like it was going to be so good, and then it was not. So bad. So, yeah. so bad. So, so bad. Let me just roll some dice here. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, roll me a damage roll, please, um, Cerise, for that four sacks. Uh, 19 points of four sacks damage, Babu. Uh, I rolled low. You did. Yeah. Four sacks, though. That's still inertia, isn't it? I mean. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Okay. Let me see if I can pull this off. Or should I say, let me see if South Ari can pull this off. Yes, he does. Okay. Um, Safari, realizing that the situation has gone to hell in a handbasket, um, uh, drags a uh, grenade out of his pocket and pulls the pin. Suicide by frag grenade. Can I get everybody who's conscious? to give me a reaction speed check, please. Uh, 
Okay. It, does does cat get any bonus from rolling a one? No. Oh, I think, well, uh, no. <laughs> That's balls. Sorry, dude. Okay, so um, Cerise, you're going, to, you're going to take the full full brunt of this. Everybody else is only going to take half damage. Um, Doc's actually because Doc's prone and partially in cover from being fall, being felled by the initial dose grenade, he's only going to take half damage from this as well. Um, the Sathar are going to take full damage, and the ship's going to take damage too. So this is not this could be dangerous. This could be nastily dangerous. Oh man, I got to fix that. A little bit of spackle. Nobody will ever know. <laughs> so I'm going. I'm just going to go across the top of the, across the top of the game, the game board. So evoke. Um, this will be hard. So uh, twenty, twenty-seven fragmentation damage. Gotcha. Uh, Doc. Oops, wrong one. Wrong one. That's what I wanted. Right. Uh, Doc, 28 points of fragmentation damage. Hey, does that wake me up? 28, uh, no. I'm still asleep? At this stage, yes. Well, he's still knocked out from the dose grade, yes. Okay. Um, cat. Uh, this is hard for you too. Uh, Twenty-three for you. Mm. And you ran, uh, the, you ran down or round up? No, that round is halved down. already. It's already been halved. I uh, halved it already. But if you have an inertia screen or a skin suit, then it's half again. Yeah, yeah, and it's rounded down in that case. Uh, Wow, it's taking a long time to register. Uh, come on, what's uh, taking so long? Uh, you take 53 points, Cerise. 53, okay. Uh, Babu. Got to have yours as well. This is nineteen points for you, Babu. One nine. Now the Sethar. Uh, well, that'll kill him. And it'll definitely kill him. And it'll kill him. Um, and it will kill him. And it will really hurt him. Okay. Uh, so, um, most of the South are a, sol uh, a chunky salsa. Um, in fact, the only one who's the only one who's still alive is Sapphire H, who is heavily wounded and in entangled. And has slightly different markings on his carapace on his head than the others. Now that you look at it closely, um, what do you want to do, guys? I want to shoot him. Then shoot him. Yeah, I've been, I, can we out of initiative? Uh, not if you're going to shoot him. <laughs> well, I mean, so who's, whose turn is it then? Uh, well, um, what's everybody going to be doing? Using, a, I'm going to try to use, I. Would they let patch? me carry a so well. well? Why are you making up your mind? What's everybody else doing? 
Cat? Uh, I may as well wake up the doc. All right. So, Reese, you want to shoot him? Babs, what are you going to be doing? I am going to move into the uh, Sassar ship to provide cover for the guys while Doc's getting awoken. All right. Well, the far airlock door is closed, and there's 10 yeah. grenade threads and Sassar bodies between you and the airlock door, but you can certainly cover the airlock door, if that's what you're asking, if that's what you want yeah. to do. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Okay. All right. Well, Cerise, take your shot then. And you missed. And you hit. And you hit. And he's dead. There you go. Quick first aid and then press onward into the ship. Well, um, here's the thing. Um, so, Doc, you get woken up. You're wounded and everybody else is wounded, looks like. Yeah. Um, I'm pretty badly hurt, actually. I think most people are very badly hurt, to tell you the truth. So, uh, do we hear from the from our bridge? Um, well, as I said, two things happen. One, um, you hear you hear the the Sathar, um ship um, uh, docking clamps disengaging, um, and you also hear um, uh, your own engines. Um, uh, um, pitch up in, in, in noise. I close the, the airlock. Okay. Yeah. Probably a good thing. Um, so yeah. Um, with everybody on our side of the airlock. Yeah, obviously. Yes. Yeah. And I, I run the engineering because I got a job to do. All right. So you run, you go to engineering. What's everybody, uh, you, you, what's everybody else doing? Doc or uh, you first adding people or what's the story? What are you doing? Cat and Therese and uh, Babu? Uh, I think Babu should get a little bit of either first aid or even minor surgery and then right. head off to the uh, gunner seat. Right. Okay. I think we'll head to the bridge. All right. Cat's not wounded, so she can go straight to the bridge. Right, okay. So as you guys... We have a med bay, don't we? A med bay? You do have a med bay, yeah. Well, there would be one. Um, if you want to get... you, if, that, if that's where you're heading with... Um, heading with... Uh, ba Babu, I assume? Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, a um, couple of things. Um, so you feel the ship's... You feel the ship accelerate, because um, gravity gets heavier. Um... You, when you reach the airlock door, it's been locked. It's been frozen, like the internal airlock in, can, um, has been frozen. Okay, and I need you to make um, um, basically a, uh, um, a, a half intuition, half logic check from everybody, please. Oops, I only meant to click that once. Okay. What? Ah, oh, darn uh, it! What was logic? Intuition. Yeah, I made it either way. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Um, thank you, Doc. Um, the um, you can hear a you can hear a, a a hissing sound, like a breach in the hull. Yes, possibly. I. I mean, engineering would have, well, can I find it? Uh, you can search for it. Yeah, it'll take a few minutes, obviously, to search around. I'm assuming you're searching around near the airlock where the, where the grenade yeah, where went the off. Yeah, where the grenade went off. And yeah, potentially, okay. well, actually, I wasn't awake for the fight, but I say if they used any projectiles, look for where a bullet might have gone through the hole. Yeah. 
Okay. Well, um, it'll take you a while to search the entire area. So I'm assuming you're going to concentrate on the airlock area first. Mm -hmm. All right. So what's now while while that's happening, what's everybody else doing? What's the rate of decompression? I mean, is it dangerous that we got to get it sealed now, or we have a couple minutes to seal it? Oh, you have a you have a couple of minutes to seal it by sounds things. You no one's having any trouble breathing, and there's no there's there's no tug, there's no atmospheric tug that you would get with a major breach. Yeah, I mean, I I have a mech cast. That one, it says that I can scan a mechanism and show the internal working parts, cracks or breaks. Yeah, but that's, we're talking an entire ship, dude. So it's going to take you a couple. It's going to take you a couple of turns to do it. The whole, you know, the whole yeah. deck. What I'm saying. So we know what you're doing. What's everybody else doing? Are we going to go to bed bay. Well, you can't because the airlock won't open. The interior airlock well, is sealed. I guess I uh, will give Babu first aid then for starters. Okay. So you get first aid, Babs. That's 10 points back and a bio court doc off your med kit. Although it shouldn't be a problem because of him. Yep, there you go. Cat, what are you doing? Uh, well, with my engineering background, would I get the idea that I need to fix this hole before the airlock will open? Uh, yeah, that's probably what's causing it at this stage. Yeah, well, I will assist with looking for the hole and hopefully okay. there's a there's a patch somewhere that we can use. Oh, they'd be, be patching your engineering kits. They'd be shit yeah. patches. Uh, Therese, what about you? What are you doing? I will do the same. I will also call up to the captain and tell him that we've repelled the South R borders. We have a minor hole breach. Okay. There's no acknowledgement um, to that report. Um, guys, would you uh, could you give me the search rolls, please, Boke and Cat? Did you want one from Cerise? Well, uh, Cat, yes, please. Cat doesn't find it. Um, you can't find anything. There's no hole breach as far as you can see, guys. Uh, hit some noise. All. Go up to engineer. Watch, we can't go up. Can we? Up the engineering. No. And in fact, in fact, can I can I get uh, those who have engineering skill of any sort? Um, can you give me a, a, a logic check or an intuition check? Your choice. I, no logic. It's got to be a logic check. Yeah, I'm looking for a powder, like if we have flour or something like that that we could use as a telltale. Is Cerezo engineer? I have technician. Oh. No, I actually need engineering, mate. Actual engineering, I'm afraid. So I knew Cat picked it up, I think, right? Yeah. Oh, almost Cat. Lol. Well, I saw the double zero. Did you? Yeah, I was. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, okay, Voke, um, it dawns on you that the airlock, that, that the rate of pressure differential is not enough to make the airlock not work. Something else is keeping the airlock closed. And there's a hissing noise still. And there's a hissing noise. Very faint, but it is there. Is that because it's the hissing of a snake? No, there's no snake. No, the snakes, snakes on planes, no. Uh, wait, wait, is it coming it from to... any of the cargo? No. it's yeah, Well, you have to search around to find out where it's coming from. Yeah, I thought look again to find if I can locate the source of the sound itself. Yeah, um, everybody can do that if they want, unless someone's doing uh, medical stuff on somebody else, for example. I'm going to try to override the uh, the lock on the um, elevator shaft out. Okay. Um, Cat, um, in fact, you don't find anything, but Cat, it appe the noise appears to be coming from the vent. Oh, I take a I asked my Atmos Kaz if there's any toxins in the air. No, there's no, well, there's uh, there's traces of dose gas, but you'd expect that. Um, th there's no um, 
there's no uh, toxins you can tell, um, but um, it, there is a there is a drop of pressure. I put on my gas mask. Okay. Well then. Okay. Um, it's actually quite difficult, Cerise. Um, it's almost as if um, it, your your efforts are being actively um, actively um, um, opposed, but you do get you do manage to get the airlock open. Okay, and I will I will pass that on to everybody that um, it's harder than it should be. I feel like the end of this scene has to uh, end with a I'm sick and tired of these motherfucking snakes on our motherfucking plane. <laughs> <laughs> there's no snakes on plane. I'm telling you, there's no snakes on board. Okay. Now look, everything, 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 everything is pointing to everything as far as you can see is pointing to a hole breach, except the fact you can't find a hole breach, and the noise isn't coming from the hole. So is it being pumped out by the ventilation system? Yeah. Other, could be the, so how many how many other people case. were on board besides the five of us? Uh, Lieutenant Taby and um, Sub Lieutenant or oh, Junior Robert Lieutenant Class. Okay, so one of them is a South R agent, and the other one is now <laughs> dead. Yep. Oh, uh, dear. And there's a hole breach somewhere else in the ship, and that's why we're not able no, to... No, get... I think they're pumping the oxygen out of our chamber. Anyway, so the, so the, the airlock door is open. Um, uh, Voke, with all... Sorry, Doc, with all that's been going on, you could have been... You could be uh, doing surgery on somebody if you wanted, or first aid on others if you wanted. Okay, well, I've given Babu first aid. Does anyone else need it? I do. I mean, yeah, Kat could have gotten first aid because she's something down. Yeah, I, okay. I think we all need it. It's a matter of who was too, who was not too busy to get it. Yeah. Well, we, we, we don't. We didn't... Hurt worse. I don't think it really matters. Do, do it for everybody, mate, including yeah. yourself. Including yourself. Was off. That's ten points back, Vogue. Cat. Awesome. Oh, just but yeah, ten points back, Cat. Cerise. And ten points Thank back you. for you, Cerise. Mwah. And ten points back for the doctor. Okay. Um so so if only that, there was first aid for skin suits. <laughs> so anyway, what you've got is um, the five of you uh, with, have been first aided. Um, you discovered what I've already told you, and the airlock doors open. What are you doing? We're going. I'm going to the bridges. <laughs> yeah, You're going kinda. to the bridge. Yeah. Yep. Me too. Okay. Cat's going to bridge. Vote's going to bridge. What is Doc and Babu doing? Does Babu want surgery? I think he should have it before we get. Actually, I'm going to engineering. More. You're going to engineering. Okay. So we have a med bay for all of me. All right. All right. So, um, Voke, you're going to engineering. What are you going to be doing down in engineering? Identifying if there is a hole breach anywhere and trying to figure out what could be uh, if the ventilation systems are pumping out oxygen. Trying to find using the terminals the source, what the hissing sound is. Yeah. Okay. That's what you're doing. Doc, you're doing. Show. Yeah. You're doing. You're doing surgery on Babu. We'll get to that in a moment. Cat and Cerise, you're going to the bridge. Is that right? Yep. What are you going to do when you get there? Or what uh, you plan to do when you get there? I'm expecting one of the two officers to be unconscious or dead, and the other one to be a South R agent. Yeah, yeah, but that doesn't tell me what you're going to do. My, yeah, I guess my plan is to find two officers that aren't responding because that's my biggest concern right now, and then see where this ship is taking off to. In other words, you're going in gas masks on, guns up, shields on. Yeah, expecting trouble. If one officer's down, then it's going to be subduing the other one. If they're both down, it's going to be looking for how they were injured. 
looking for other threats. Uh huh. Okay. All right. So um, you two arrive on the bridge. Um, you better both give me initiative rolls because um, you necessarily and, aren't necessarily. Yeah, and I'm doing four sacks, not rifle. Where's Babu? Yeah, uh, in mid bay. Oh. Getting patched up after the last time you got slapped around. Yeah, I believe it's just Ceres and I, so I hope it's not a tough battle. All right. Okay, so the door opens up. Um, the following happens in, in quick succession, so don't, don't, I'll, I'll, give, I'll let you know when you can act. Um, um, you can see um, uh, Lieutenant Clast slumped over um, the, uh, uh, communication panel. Um, Lieutenant KB is on the far side of uh, the uh, of a um, one of the um, one of the consoles, aiming what appears to be an electro stunner at you. Um, and he actually gets the shot off at you before you can do anything else. Um, and um odds it'll be cerise evens it'll be cat it's cerise um now an electro stunner does 40 40 10 i think from memory that sound right doesn't it yeah it does yeah it depends on whether it's on stun or no it's not on stun uh so 16 points of electro of, of electrical damage to you Cerise, obviously, it's a beam weapon, so um, the albedo suit shouldn't nah, help. Yeah, it's gorse screen. It's a gorse screen, yeah. Six. Yeah, one six. Okay. Okay. Um, and then you, and then um, you. So he's on the far side with some cover, um, and you guys are in the um, in the just in the open door of the airlock. What are you doing, Cerise? You've got the next. Can action. I charge him and attack? Well, he's on the far side of a console, so... Can I um, jump in, or...? You, you can attempt to. Either way, uh, we're not firing gyro jets and projectile weapons on the bridge. I think, I think that's a given. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't think it was a given. That's why I'm asking. All right, so if you yep. want to you know, you know, run across the bridge and leak the console and, and what, have a, sli have a slice of him at the same time, is that what you're trying to do? Yep, that's what I'm trying to do. All right, I need you to make me a um, pardon me. I need you to make me a dexterity check, and if you get the dexterity check in, that'll work. I am seriously impressed. Can you imagine if we shot projectile weapons on the bridge? Uh, we'd never fucking live, live it down from Voke. <laughs> he would be whining for the next five years. He would, wouldn't he? Um, okay, Cerise does, and, and for don't forget, Cerise is a is a um, Vrask, so has um, eight legs and two arms. Does some sort of twisting backflip um, over the top of um, the console, landing beside Lieutenant Taby and pl slicing slicing at him with her sword, I believe. Four sacks, yep. Four sacks, yeah. Okay, Cat, uh, what are you? <laughs> What are you doing? Uh, I am not so eager to jump over consoles, but I will walk as far as I can and be ready to attack next round. Yes, that's perfectly yeah. fine. You can do that. All right. Uh, in which case, you better give me some initiative go Initiative for you guys, please. Oh, that's not good. And remember, if you put a hole in, if you put a crack in the That's good. glass, I'm at the engineering console, so I'll see it. I'll get a bright <laughs> red warning. Yeah. Are we all together no, there? No, you're no, screwing no, my no. ship. No, you, you, unfortunately, it's just Cat and Therese at the moment. Oh, no, no, no. I know. I'm, I'm just doing the consoles, but, you know, if they damage my ship. Um, gonna... Are you going, uh, uh, Doc, are you doing minor or major surgery? I believe the request was for minor surgery. 
Babu, how many points do you need? Hold on, hold on. I am down 30, 28 points. Well, a minor will give you 20, a major will give it all of you, all of it back. Twenty would work. We can do the major and get it all back. You know. Well, you've way. got you've got a sick you got the sick base that counts as that, that gives you a plus twenty percent chance, Doc. Okay, minor surgery it is then. Okay. And you get a plus twenty percent. You get a, you get a bonus of twenty percent, which you didn't need. <laughs> um. In fact, in fact. Yeah, you get, 20, you get 20 points back, Babu. All right, Kat, you've got first action. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, well, Thank you, Doc. Deny it. Uh, uh, I guess. And you better give you better give me a, a, a quick a, a intuition and watch your check, please. You too, Cerise. Well, that doesn't really affect you. Yeah, well, that's not going to happen. Why not? Did you want half and half or one or the other? Half and half if you can. Oh, I thought that was 99. Whoops. No, it's a 59, mate. You're right. Um, okay. Uh, Cat, there's a slight humming coming from Lieutenant Tabey. A humming? Yeah. Hmm. Do I... It would be... I, I would know from my uh, dealings with our protocols, he would be wearing a skin suit, wouldn't he? He is. Okay. Because uh, I don't really want to murder him. Uh, it would be nice to knock him out. Uh, actually, I believe I have a sonic stunner for this very use. Uh, I am going to not attack him with my sonic sword. Uh, and grab my sonic stunner. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll let, let Cerise wear his stamina down. Uh, yeah. Cool. Uh, so that means I won't attack this round. Okay. Because I'll be putting my sword away and get the okay. stunner out. Sure. 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 Uh, in that case, no worries. Oops. Sorry. I hit it at the same time you did. Uh, Lieutenant Taby uh, flicks his sonic sword towards you, Cerise. Whoops. That, ignore that. The harm I heard wasn't the, the sound of a sonic sword, was it? No, that's now, then you can now hear the sonic sword. You can now hear the sonic sword sound. Got it. On top of whatever the other sound, the other humming was. Um, what was I up to? Um, mind control or a bomb? No, it's not, doesn't, well, mind control maybe, but it's not a bomb. Uh, 40, 40, 10 for sonic sword, isn't it? Or is it five? Uh, five. Sonic sword is 5d10, but it has no punch score. Yeah. And it's plus 15. Yeah, and it's 38 points of damage, Therese. Okay. Um, you have an action. 38, right? so I go down. Oh, Therese drops. Um, cat. Oh, I, recons so I reconsider you, my plan. <laughs> you, better, you better give me initiatives, please. Oh, are they good? Yeah, great, nice. I don't believe that. You're up. Nice. Well, I, over my comms, I say series down, bridge. That's enough to still take an action, right? Yep. Doc, you, 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 hear, you heard that over the comm system. That'll be enough for people to come running. Uh, and then I will take a shot with my Sonic Stunner. Sure. Now, I need to remember what my two hit chance is with a Sonic Stunner. Um, let, me, let me save you the trouble. He's wearing, a, he's wearing a Hushfield. Son of a bitch. Yeah, he... Yep. Would, I, would I have recognized that sound? Um, well, probably not. You've never actually come across one before. Yes, we have. A Sonic, a Hushfield? 
Yeah, because I remember I was wearing it and you lolled at me because I was wearing it and for like ten minutes and drained my entire battery pack. Oh yeah, I did that. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, well, I'll tell you what. Uh, give me a, 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 either either logic or intuition. Your choice to recognise it. Yep, you recognise it. Okay, so we'll say that I ignored my turn last time. Yeah, 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 but, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'll attack with my sonic sword then. Oh, well, it fuck. won't help either. <laughs> it's a, a hush field. Uh, okay. Ah, oh, Jesus. Uh, what have I got? I've only got my. I've only got my needle pistol, which won't work. Uh, and I have my projectile weapon. I guess that's. Or you could, or you could use a pistol. You could use the pistol. You could pistol. You could beat him over the head with a with club, with the pistol butt. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Well, I guess projectile weapon it is. Am I in? Yeah. A... Jesus. Uh. Yeah. I'll take. I'll take my three shots at him. You want a three shot? Or you want a burst? I'm not doing a burst on the bridge. <laughs> I'm. Well, he's got. He's got a skin suit. I'm just saying. Yeah. No. No. We just. Ah, dear, this is not good. <laughs> moral dilemmas. Well, not necessarily moral dilemmas, but dilemmas. Uh, can I actually run over and grab Cerise's force axe? It'll be the only thing you do this round. It's on the it's on the far side of him. Yeah. But yeah, you could. Let me do, do you, that. But you won't get the attack in. No, no, I, I know, but I, right. I, I well, don't want give me to. Yeah. A, give me your reactions. Give me your reaction speed check as a, as a bit of a, as a dodge because he's going to swing at you, okay? He, but he wasn't expecting that. Neither was I. Unfortunately, no. So let's see if he hits you with his sonic sword. Oh, son of a bitch. No, I, well, no. Sorry, I feel like I'm trying to kill you. I'm not. Um, he missed. Excellent. Initiatives. So you're on a 13. You need a babu to roll? No, nope. you guys are in surgery, dude. Well, it's yeah, but I thought we heard the call and... Uh, yeah, it's, it's going to take you a while. Uh, it's, you, you've got to get out the door, up the lift, and yeah, it's going to take a while before you get yeah, there. Yeah, Doc has uh, to wake you, you up first. Well, yeah. Uh, yeah so, hang, just having said that, before... Uh, before um, what are what are Vogue, you're still in engineering. You heard the call for, you heard the call for Cerisa as well. Then I'd be going up. You're going up. Okay, Doc, you heading up? Yeah, I guess so. And obviously, Babu, you're heading up as well. Yep. All right, so I'll get you to go. I'll get you to roll initiative when you get there. That which works. Won't be for, which won't be for a, a moment or two here. Um, uh, what was the initiative? Um, yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> okay. So, Tebby takes another swing at you, Cat. This one connects. Oh, that's... I'm going to re-roll that. <laughs> what, Twelve. You get four ones? Yes. Twelve. Twelve nice. points of damage. Out of a possible 50. Can you say pissed off? Cat can. You Sweet. won't be able to for much longer. <laughs> Cat, go for your life. All right. So this will say Sonic Sword, but it's the same attack. Yeah, yeah. It's just, yeah. Just add your punch score to it. Fucking that's hell. A, that's a miss, dude. Initiative, please. I had one chance not to die, and I missed it. Well, maybe not. Hey. And you've got another chance not to die. That's better. Damage. Don't forget to add your punch score. Uh, this is, what is my punch score? 
Uh, yeah, strength score rounded down twenty divided by twenty rounded down. Uh, rounded up. All right. Uh, strength is forty five. So it's three. So thirty five. Thirty five. Okay, yeah, Taby goes down, but he's still not minus he's still not at minus thirty, which means he's still alive. Well Excellent. unconsciously down, yeah. I I um, will yeah, I will say yeah, I will tell people to get their butts up here. All right. Uh Cerise, how many what do you what stamina are you on? I'm ten under. Oh, you're yeah, actually more than that because there's been three rounds since, so you're actually 13 under. I'll slap a Stato. Yeah. Like... On who? On Cerise. Right, so you're at minus 13 then, and alive but, but hurt. And um, I would be doing the same to the lieutenant. Okay. All right. Don't want to um, die. So just as, just as Kat puts a um, slap patch of some sort on Lieutenant Taby, everybody else arrives in the, uh, 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 arrives and sees um, Lieutenant Clast um, slumped over the communications panel. Cerise, um, you can see part of Cerise from behind a panel, behind a panel, uh, behind the console, and uh, Cat's on the same side of the console as Cerise and Lieutenant Taby. You can see Lieutenant Taby's foot. <laughs> they all accuse Cat of mutiny. <laughs> yeah, they all accuse Cat of mutiny. <laughs> What's everybody doing? Did Cat uh, miss with the when she shot her pistol? Oh, actually, no, she grabbed the. Yeah. She grabbed the sword. She didn't want to use the pistol for some strange reason. I don't know why. I was about to check for any holes. Yeah. Well, I, there's some in there's some in there's some in um, there's some in Cat and there's some in. Um, that there's uh, one Cerise. in class. It's, no, it's not one in class actually. Well, is class alive? Oh uh, well, um, possibly it's up for the doctor to determine. I'm going to say, uh, well, uh, restrain Lieutenant Tabby or Tabby. Uh, he appears to be a Sethar agent. And then we need to get the cyanide pill out of his mouth. Again, that's the doc. Yeah, okay. Yep. I guess that's top priority then. All right. Well, um, you'll have to first aid him or at least stabilize him first because it, it, yeah. Um, and then you can go in and do my and give me a minor surgery roll to take his to take to find and take the suicide capsule out of his tooth if he's got one. So by first aiding him, he's not going to be fighting me to remove the tooth. Well, he's no, he's down okay, too far. Otherwise, I do the tooth first. Yeah, no, you first. Well, you got to stabilize. It's a first aid to stabilize him anyway. Whether you choose to give him the point, whether you choose to give him the ten points back or not, it's up to you. But it's still a that's still the role to stay, make sure he's stable. So yeah, okay. Uh, now I said it's a minor surgery if you wanna if you wanna get the tooth. Okay, I'll work on the tooth. I guess I'm a dentist now as well. Well, you're a medic. It's the same thing. Uh, no, you do not locate any 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 um, cyanide tooth. Does he get the plus twenty from the med bay? No, no, he's not in the med bay. Well, he might have a tooth. He might not. I can't find one. You're all on the bridge at the moment. Okay, then get Cerise up. Yeah, and I need to keep him under. Cat can start sending messages to command. So I guess both Cerise and Cat need first aid then, yeah? Uh, Cerise and Cat, you really should check out, you really should check out Lieutenant Clast. Um, and you probably want to restrain... Um, Lieutenant Taby, if you haven't already. And then anyone else needs medical attention. I do not uh, appreciate how kinky stuff works in this universe. How do we, do, what do we have to restrain? <laughs> <laughs> and we find something so he can't, uh, a gag for his mouth. So if he did have a tooth that we didn't find. No, the best thing to do if we want to strain him is just not, not let him gain consciousness. Ooh. Yeah, you should probably restrain him anyway, as well. Yeah. Um, so um, the other thing you can do is you can take it. If you if you were to take him down to Med Bay, 
um, you would be entitled to another another uh, minor surgery check to see if you can find and remove the tooth if, if it's there. Because the circ because circumstances circumstances would have changed. Can we put him in a freeze field? Sorry. Can we use freezer? Uh, can you put a freeze field on him? Yeah, if you got one. Do we have one? Well, you should be one in your med kit, isn't there? Well, I've got a med kit. I thought. Well, I have a med then, you'd, then you'd have a then you'd have a freeze kit, a freeze field, yeah. So Some what's that for? Get the tooth out. Because the last South our agent field. we found yeah. did have one, and you know, mm. oh, well, he's he's in the freeze field now, so that's Toby taken care of. Um, you want to? You, I said you need to. You need the uh, cat and Therese both need first aid and surgery possibly, and Lieutenant Class is still out, so you want, might want to check her out as well. Yeah, well, uh... stabilize her first. Okay. So a diagnostic roll for the, that one, mate. Uh, that's good enough. Um, yeah, look, she's been, she's been knocked out. looks like she was knocked out by the, by, via Tabie's, um, electro stunner. And the way she's faced forward, she was probably shot in the back. So you can bring her around if you want. Tim Dace will bring her around if you want to do that. Yeah, I yeah. guess so. Mm -hmm. I am also, uh, reloading the stem dose in my body comp, my med inject. Yeah, good. Fair enough. I'm assuming you're doing that too, Cat. And yeah. Ceres. And Ceres. Later, unless you guys do it to me, I'm still unconscious. Oh yeah, that's right. I need first aid then major surgery. Okay, first aid then. Okay. Uh, so that's oh, only just. Oh no, no, I'm, don't mind me. I'm going nuts. Um, ten points back, Cerise, and then major surgery. You, you're going to take him down to the med bay as well. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, don't you can have the plus twenty percent then. Not that you needed it, but anyway. So you're fully healed, Cerise. Cat, I'm assuming you're down in med bay as well by now. Uh, with a with a uh, with a uh. First aid, I'm 17 down. No, I won't. Well, you, you, no, you won't. That's fine. Do it later then. Let's go. Do it later. Yeah, that's fine. If I got first aid, I'm at 53. So. Yeah, well, you got first aid, so there you go. All right. Um. So are you? somebody suggested you getting onto the radio cat. Does anyone else want to do anything on the, up, while they're up there on the bridge? Uh, or back up on the bridge once you get healed? I, I guess I would be checking the computer for logs of any transmissions to snaky like ships. Sure, you can do that. So, am I conscious and can head back to the bridge? If you want, now you take yeah a few minutes. Like it takes a few minutes, but yeah. Yeah. So then I I go up to the pilot's chair and the uh -huh. first thing I'm going to do is scan for that freighter. Yeah, it's right on the limit of um, it's right on the limit of um. Of the scan range, um, it's effectively managed to uh, manage to, to to escape with all the kerfuffle. Uh, it's heading out system. Can I? Can we catch it? We're faster no. than it. Yeah, no, nah, probably not. Um, you because you're heading in the, you're heading in a different direction, so you got to you'd have to you know change directions, move around, and get them by that stage to be out of scan range. And the minute it's out of scan range, it's I mean, if it were me. Minute you get out of scan range, you change direction. To foil, that's how you lose pursuit. Yeah, let let's still go that way and see if we get lucky. We'll we'll pick a we'll randomly guess which way we think it's going to zig. And you'll zig that way as well, eh? And we'll zig that way. We'll predict that and cut and vector for that. Okay. Um... And then. Let everybody yep. know to send send command a status report. Sure. And I'm checking on, I'm finishing my check of the ship. All right. So you better give me an engineering role then for the checking the ship. What do you want? An oh, um. Actually, make, give, just make it, make it a logic role because you've got the skills. Yeah, okay. Yeah, now look, the ship's in pretty good nick. 
hasn't it wasn't it hasn't been damaged at all or um, so you, no it doesn't seem to have been sabotaged cat did you want to do that computer you have to, you've got access you've just got to do the uh, search information okay um there is uh there is a bit of uh, there is a communication log um uh between uh coming in from somewhere the head is um the header the header on the message doesn't make sense um it's been scrambled somehow um and in fact the message doesn't make sense it, it doesn't make much sense um either it's uh it's um it's parcel single tongue. hey it's parcel tongue it's the word green piece okay no no harry potter references allowed here okay oh is that what it was I, uh, we were just uh, watching it today I, I've, I've, the, never, I've never seen oh, it. It's the talking to the snakes language in Harry oh, Potter. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> no, it's the word Greenpeace. Okay. And it was, it was um, the, message, uh, the message was routed, it was uh, it, it addressed, in inverted commas, to Lieutenant Taby. Interesting. Is that how the sleep regents work? Do we know? Like there's a trigger word that... Um, Makes them go nuts. Yeah, if 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 they're that way controlled, if they're an actual agent, agent, it just could be it just could be a, a signal word. <coughs> Pardon me. It just could be yeah, you know, just a, just a, a a code word signal. Did yeah. any of the possible hijackers actually make it on board? Um, yeah. Um, the sapphire. Yeah, there's a bunch of sapphire in the in the airlock, in your airlock, your external airlock. Or corpses, anyway. Yeah. Keep their bodies. Yep. All right. Uh, somebody was somebody going to be radioing back to HQ. Yeah, I was going to do that. What were you saying? What were you going to say? Uh, I mean, a everybody on the frontier likes to know about a Sathar encounter. Um, so we should probably <laughs> uh report back that we encountered Sathar and. Uh, I don't know whether we want to talk about Lieutenant Taby yet on over the radio, uh, but just I, well, you you could always say Lieutenant Lieutenant Taby's um, been incapacitated. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, I, I I would say that uh, that the Sathar ship escaped. Uh, we have we have some corpses on board, uh, ready for a set experimentation when we get back. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, yeah, yeah. The same yeah, 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 yeah. is a race that we don't actually understand a lot about, right? So, oh, not really. Yeah, you've never, you've never managed to capture a live one. Yeah, well, we, they, we they still always haven't. Commit, yeah, they always, they always commit suicide. Yeah. Um, so um, a couple of hours later, a message comes back in for you to report back to Clarion Station um, as soon as possible. Um, Further details are requested um, on Lieutenant Taby, um, and a full a full medical uh, not a full a full status a status report on ship and crew is also requested. Do we okay. feel our comms are encrypted? That they're secure? Uh, you can you can you can you generally yes. Um, you can request a secure channel if you wanted. Other you than know, a more secure channel if you wanted. Yeah, I would definitely do that. All right. Um, what what has the other lieutenant told us now that she's awake? Um, that um, she had just noticed that the freighter didn't look like a standard freighter when she was um, uh, when she was obviously knocked unconscious and then woke up to find you guys standing over. Her. How how did it differ from a standard freighter? It didn't look right. The aesthetics, the styling. Yeah, yeah, it didn't look right. Didn't have the standard. Didn't look like one of our standard freighters. Okay. Um, Kat, did you want to do any more digging into the computer? Yeah, I mean, if I could find any more references to Greenpeace or any other co communications that look weird like this, sure. uh, I'd definitely be looking for that. And I'll give the display info. I'll, I'll put some penalties on it. Hmm. 
Okay, you managed to actually ferret um, ferret into um, the personal log spaces of everybody. Um, I'm assuming you're not going after your own crew, your, your, your fellow posse members, but going after Lieutenant Tabey's um, personal records. I feel like if I was other James, I would be, but uh, <laughs> not me. You what? You mean hacks? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He would. He would, wouldn't he? He would. <laughs> no, no, just just our the non-budget crew. And then, well, Lieutenant, um, what, including Lieutenant uh, Lieutenant Class? I uh, yeah, I think so. At this point in time, I. There's nothing. There's nothing of interest in Lieutenant Class's um, uh, thing apart from, apart from uh, a few references to. Um, uh, apparently, she was having an affair with one of the other lieutenants who died in the attack um, on the pirate base, and she's been rather cut up about that for the last couple of months, as you can imagine. Um, but uh, but yeah, apart from that, um, Lieutenant Taby, on the other hand, uh, apparently. Um, he had received orders um, two or three years ago um, about uh, the Safar wanting to capture um, an assault scout because they haven't been able to uh, replicate the performance of the UPF ship. Um, and uh, apparently Greenpeace was um, a code uh, to put the plan into action. Uh, which you guys obviously foiled by your uh, your, your quick actions uh, with the Tengra. Actually, I think the Tengra grenade is what saved you, personally. Um, by not dying? By, and by not dying. Their plans? Yes, by not dying, you ruined their plans. Uh, they were quite happy to capture you alive, by the way, and do experiments on you. Well, that was hence my plan was not to die. Yeah, hence, hence the doze grenades as opposed to the frag grenades straight off. <laughs> Um, so yeah, so apparently there's a there was a nasty plan to uh, to uh, capture the osprey. Um, yes. Well, mm. we get our more secure channel, and then we give them an update on that. Uh, Tabby is a Sathar agent and has been. Yeah. Put in, put so in you, freeze field. Yeah. So you make it back to, uh, you, you get back to uh, Clarion Station and go through several days of debrief and and explaining and things like that. Tabby's obviously um, taken into arrest um, and so forth. So, uh, so yeah. Uh, three points experience each, people. Um, so well done in that regard. Um, and yes, you, uh, you, uh, um, I said, well done. Woohoo! We didn't die. Woohoo! You didn't Yay. die. So, um, junior, uh, Lieutenant, uh, Lieutenant class is promoted to full Lieutenant. Um, and given ex given command of the Osprey with you as her crew. Um, so, uh, so yes. Um, eventually, Lieutenant Taby um, is found guilty of uh, sedition and uh, of being a traitor um, and is executed. Uh, but not after not after um, uh, revealing what he knew what he knows about the satire, which isn't that much really. Um, what the most puzzling thing about it is, is that he didn't does he did not appear to be um, under any sort of mind control. He volunt he voluntarily um, wanted to harm the Clarion and the UPF and the and the Federation. Bad did he news. ever say why? Nope. Yet did not it, a it... nope. Did we ever learn where he was recruited? Uh, he was recruited or from how? Clarion. He's actually he's actually from Clarion. He's a native. But I mean, was he approached by another agent? What did he was he on vacation? No, he, he, he no, never never comes up. 
and he's never never revealed one interesting fact though apparently he apparently he uh, he's um uh, apparently he had ties to the liberation front of clarion um who wanted to turn the because clarion's a monarchy don't forget yep uh, um and the liberation people wanted it, wanted it to be a democracy so that's the only sedition link apart from the south are themselves so whether that's how it, whether that's how it um how uh, it was recruited or maybe you know maybe somebody knew he was this this is this enfranchised with things and got him got him on the on the on the side somehow but apparently apparently he's been based on the fact that the plan came in a couple of years ago um he's been a um he's been a a, a sapphire agent slash sympathizer for a number of years working his way up the clarion marines um suffice it to say um a lot of people are bought in and uh in uh and undergone um psychoanalytic psychoanalyst and lie detection throughout the marines yeah including including you lot not the most pleasant of experiences but not not torture by any means it's par for the course it's par for the course say so, yes um quick five minute bathroom break guys yep yep yeah sounds good yep, yep. back soon good reason to be paranoid Hey, for those of you back, initiative is one is one tenth rounded up of your reaction speed. Is that right? Yes. Okay, so I should actually increase my initiative. Yeah, which is why being at fifty-one is way better than being at fifty. Yeah.
Yeah, I need to make sure all my skills and stuff are right. Hey, Rai, what is Pilot 3? How 30. many experience? 30? Yep. Pilot's 10 per level. I think I'm Pilot 2, right? Yeah. So I need 30. Well, I'm almost there. Okay, are we all back? Yeah, probably. Yeah, probably. Um, did you guys want to spend any, any of those experience points? Yeah, I'm putting mine into logic. Okay. Anyone else? Save it for a rainy day. Yeah, save it for a after rainy day. Pilot three. <laughs> Fair enough. Is it with with Babu's skills as they are? Is is that given that astrogation's kind of a out of ship combat type maneuver? Uh, is there any benefit for the team for at to focus on like beam weapons or projectile weapons so that we have an extra gunner? Uh, what have you got, Babu? Rocketry or beam weapons? Rocketry, uh, projectiles. Yeah, so obviously, um, if you're going to do that, then beam weapons would be the cho obvious choice, Cad. And, and do I need beam four or beam two to get to ship gunnery? You need beam six. Jesus Christ, uh, that's not going to happen. Um, all right, well, then scrub that idea. Because uh, there's no way that Cat's getting to beam six. Because uh, what's beam six? For a non-combat PSA? Um, level 1 6, level 2 is 12, 18, 
24, 36. Yeah, that's a lot. All right. Uh, hmm. Hmm. But someone needs to do it. Hmm. Well, who's, who's, well, the logical person would be the person with the most beam weapon skill, obviously. Which was Jazz, and that's what Jazz mm. was gunning for. That's what, ga- that's what Jazz took. Well, yeah. Uh, okay. Um, well, I mean, given that we have a big hole in energy weapons right now, I think I'll still probably take uh, Beam 2. It's 12 points. Yeah. Assuming you've got Beam 1. I do, and I yeah. think I have 13 points left, so I'll do that. Okay. Cool. Just, be, just because if we all have kinetic energy, we're just going to get shredded by something. And <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yes. I bet that Sonic Stream came as a surprise, didn't it? Yeah, well. You don't see them very often. No, you don't. But he did actually have knowledge of your knowledge of you guys after that many months serving oh, yeah. together. Yeah, it makes sense that he mm. would be wearing a sonic screen and a skin suit. Mm-hmm. That's the most likely thing to go after him with. Yeah, because everybody wears everybody wears albedo albedo screen. So why would you use laser weapons? <laughs> yeah, mm. that happens. That happens. Anyone else going to spend any experience points, or are we all, are we all good? I'm good. No, I'm good, I think. Oh, Need God, to stupid. get a new skin suit and recharge the power pack. Oh, yeah, well, there's plenty of time to do that. And it's provided for free because, you know, we're soldiers. That's right. Well, Marines, actually, but, you know. Yeah. So, so yes. what type of camouflage do uh, Space Marines use? Uh, spa- uh, um, well, it depends on, depends on the planet they're landing on um, in terms of, uh, it's mission-specific, in other words, but as a general rule, Space Black. Okay, but um, either that or, or hull gray, so that we look like the corridors. Yeah, no, gen- space black's the general uniform for uh, for the for the marines. But I mean, if you're going into a forest planet, then obviously forest green. If you're going on the desert world, like Volturnus, for example, it, it'd be desert camo. So it depends on what what you're going in. You know, so um, the Osprey and Clarion Station. Space black. That way, when you get a hole in your space suit, space suit, they can't see it. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, just making a couple of notes for myself about a few things. Don't mind me. Um, so, hang on. Ah, that's what I'm after. Oh, I better pull that up too. Hang on. Don't mind me, don't mind me. Going nuts in my old age, don't mind me. Ah, wrong file. Ah, sorry. That's the one I want. Uh, oh, pardon me, sorry. Okay. Um, so, um, your commendation, you, you, you obviously, you, you've received um, various commendations for your, your good works 
in uh, in preventing the sapphire plot to steal the osprey um and um over the next couple of months um what the hell sorry over the next couple of months um um the um Uh, the replacement uh, frigate and ships arrive. Um, the frigate um, is commissioned the Leo II. Um, the Wasp was the one that was the ship that survived, wasn't it? From memory? Yep. Yeah, I thought so. Uh, and the Osprey, of course. Let's not forget the Osprey. Um, the two replacement ships... Um, are named the uh, have been named the flitter and the swallow. Um, are, so, they bo are they both assault scouts or is one a frigate? It, no, they're both assault scout scouts. So uh, the Clarion military fleet now consists of a, the frigate, the Leo two, and four a scout, uh, four assault scouts: the wasp, the flitter, the swallow, and the osprey. That's um, pretty so, massive for a planetary militia. Um, yeah, it's one of the. It's one of. The, it's not the biggest in the frontier. Um, I do have that information somewhere. Hang on. Um, what do I do with I it? I think Dramoon is, Moon is the largest. Yeah, but Dramoon's got two two planets. It's, um, don't yep. forget. Um, where is? I, I do have that information somewhere. Now, where is it? What did I do with it? Um, num, 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 num. Oh, I know where it is. Um, I think I know where it is. Hang on. Um, sorry. It might be in the ship roster for the second Sapphire War if you... Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, um, yeah, it's, 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 I think it's the third or fourth biggest out of, out of them all, um, um, Clarion. It's, um, it's one of the bigger, one of the more um, prosperous planets in the frontier. So, um, so yeah. Yeah. Oh, pardon me. Sorry. Burping here. Um, yeah. So, uh, and of course, um, you know, uh, various, various bits of fleet, uh, fleet training, um, happens, um, with your new ships and new crewmate crew members um so uh so yes anyway so you're um you're on uh, you guys are off duty on the station actually it's it's practically night time it, it's early hours of the morning um you guys uh were have been out um enjoying yourselves in the in the um uh, nightlife of Clarion Station, the commercial aspects, having a few Yaziri nails, as they say, and uh, playing up. Bragging uh, about sapphire bodies. <laughs> Sorry, what was that? I said bragging about sapphire bodies. Bragging about sapphire bodies, um, perhaps hooking up with other um, other other marines for extracurricular activities, if you know what I mean. Or maybe not. <laughs> um, you know, you got to you got to relax however you can. A bit of horizontal jogging, I think, is one of the terms they use. I go into the clothing uh, store, look around, and you know, spend an hour there, but don't buy anything. Yeah, that'd be right. And then I walk out laughing to myself about the ideas of about the idea of clothes. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, steam bars for various individuals, I'm assuming. Oh yeah. Babs. Babu. Yeah. Babu's yep. sleeping. Babu's sleeping. Is he close he? to it? <laughs> All right. Um. Anyway. Uh. So it's like three three in the morning something like that ship uh, uh, station time whatever when the um all hands um klaxon uh goes off 
Ooga, 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 ooga. All Marines report to your duty stations. This is not a drill. Off we go. All right, let's go. I'm assuming you're grabbing your, grabbing your kit. Oh, yeah. Mm. Hang on a sec. Sorry, I just thought of something. I put no, my shell be. on. Put your shell on. Put your shell on. <laughs> well, I don't have yeah, no, it's just, yeah, no, it's just, yeah, no, yeah, 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 just, I got it, it's just, yeah. Um, so, um, uh, your duty station at, at a time like this is basically your, your, your job, you you're to report to the, uh, the, the flight briefing room. Um, uh, so, uh, you, uh, pour into the flight briefing room along with um all the other um all the other uh flight crew marines uh on your way to the briefing room there's a lot of activity a lot of senior officers um uh, and senior officers aides well the senior officers aren't running but the senior officers aides are um, something big um some large piece of fecal matter has hit the revolving atmospheric distributor um the ground marine ground marines are, are in full combat in, in full combat kit um uh so yeah um something big's happened um and in fact um uh, you happen to pass quite close to the uh, marine armory on your way to the briefing room and you can see that the um the ground marines are actually the the body tank the body tank um troops are getting are getting suited up Um, so yeah, something big has, has happened. Um, so the briefing room fills up quickly. Uh, once basically everybody's there more or less, um, the, um, pardon me, uh, Colonel, Colonel? Commander. Mm. Yeah, Commander uh, Commander Aconium um, uh, strides in um, and says, "Settle down," uh, which everyone quickly does. Um, the lights dim; uh, a hollow display lights up, uh, showing uh, the Clarion system, uh, and there are um, there's a blinking there's a blinking red icon. Um, coming in from out system at quite a uh, quite a, a decent speed. Um, we picked this up an hour ago. Uh, the section of the map zooms in uh, to show, uh, and the blinking red light, blinking red icon separates into uh, into three icons. Uh, each of them indicating um, uh, a destroyer class vessel. We've got three destroyers inbound, or accurately, we've got three, what we think are three destroyers inbound. Um, That's a pretty big problem. <laughs> um, the only, they're heading, they're heading for the planet. We're pretty sure it's a Sapphire raiding fleet. It's now, your job to stop them. Your your orders are to engage the unknown destroyers as far away from uh, Clarion as possible to save uh, innocent lives. The uh, ship size is here. It's like assault scout frigate cruiser destroyer. Uh, other way around. Uh, destroy, destroyers are smaller than cruisers. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yep. So they're one step up from a frigate. Actually, 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 to be honest, it goes, it goes fighter, assault, assault scout, corvette, frigate, destroyer, cruiser, battleship, or heavy cruiser, battleship. Gotcha. 
Are we getting any reinforcements from the UPF? There's nothing. There's nothing around. And we're four assault scouts in one frigate, right? Yep. That's right. Four assault scouts, one frigate. Okay. Destroyers. I think they've got another battery, but they're basically the same as a frigate, except that they have a lot more hull points. Standard details. Standard details on a frigate, on a destroyer. Um, typically, because no, no, two, no, two ships are the, exactly the same. But typically, um, a laser cannon, a laser battery, two torpedoes, an electron battery, and four, and a rocket battery with a, with four reloads, with three reloads, standard rocket battery. Um, reflective hull, masking screens, and ICMs. Uh, this information flashes up on the on the display in, in the hollow display. Um, standard ADF of three, movement rate uh, movement rating of three, DCR standard DCR of um, seventy five, and typically fifty hull points. That's that's a typical. That's you know. So yeah. And then what was the, the rule that I had wrong last time is that offensive fire only goes at your final uh, location. Yes, at your final movement. Okay. Gentlemen, ladies, good luck and good hunting. Dismissed. Um, at which point everybody pretty much scrambles for their ships. Okay. Any anyone, anyone have any questions? Nah. Nah. Hazard pay? <laughs> you're, you're 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 a marine, dude. Hazard pay? Um. <laughs> Okay. This is a sapphire, um, I mean. Yeah, it's has it's what you what you signed up for. Okay, listen. Um with, with five ships and five players, you can each you can each take one um to use in this battle. Um so for most important question, or one of two most important questions, who's taking the Leo two and who's taking the Osprey? I may as well take the wasp again. I took the Osprey last time, unless someone else wants to. You kept us alive. I'm good with that. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. So who's who's in the sorry who's in the wasp? Who's taking the wasp? Cat. Well, Cat. Ben. Ben. Yeah. Ben. There's so cats on Volk, board. Do you want the Leo or do you want me to take the Leo? You can take the Leo. I'll take uh, the Swallow. You take the Swallow. Ah, Ryan's in the Swallow. Yeah. Babu doesn't really know what he's doing. No, that's right. We'll turn you. Well, well why don't you take the flitter because, for that reason, and we'll walk you through it. It's pretty easy. Um, but just just basically just watch and listen to the others, and we'll see how we go. And you'll pick it up real quick. Um, flitter, 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 flitter. Um, 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 James, which means Doc, are you uh, are you taking the Osprey, Doc? Yes. Yeah, he kept us alive. Or Paul, I should say. Yeah, okay. All right. So, um, sorry, say again. It's a vote of confidence. It's a vote of confidence. All right. So, um, um, we'll use, uh, we'll use the regular, um, roles. Uh, stats for most of the most of the ships. We'll use our individual stats for the Osprey. Okay. Ah, uh, yep. All right. So uh, that that'll be damage control and everything else under the sun as per as per normal. Okay. Um, so uh, let me give do you want. I'll give you these stats again for that. If you, if you haven't got them written down somewhere, I'll um. I'll I have a these. note for the Leo too. If you want to verify that it's all good. You know, I, I, laser cannon, rocket battery, laser battery, two torpedoes. 
Yep, DCR 70 plus 40, pilot 3 plus 9 forward fire. Uh, yeah. Uh, one ADF decoy. MR3. Yeah. One decoy and, and four ICMs. Yeah. Uh, decoy? Yeah, you got a decoy. I did not know that. Yeah. And two that's masking it. screens. Oh, that would it? No, that's that, that's okay. That's what it is. That's two masking screens. Don't think that's the. I'm reading off. I'm reading off a, a off a off a scheme here, and it's someone's written in decoy. It should have been. Yeah, no, that's right. It's masking screens. Forget, forget the decoy. Okay. Okay. Babu, or James, I should say, and everybody else, if you haven't yeah. got this, just make a note for yourself the following. Okay. Um. The ship you're the ship you're controlling has a, has an a, an acceleration deceleration factor an ADF of five. Okay. ADS five. ADF five. An MR that's a movement rating a maneuverability rating sorry of four. I'm making a public note for this. Oh, good. Uh, and indeed, well, you want to, you'll probably want to keep a separate, a separate note for yourself anyway, because you're going to have to change some of these figures around as, if and when you take damage. Right. Okay. Um, and it, it's got a, a damage control rating of 50. Yep. It's got a laser battery. And four assault rockets. And it's got 15 hull points. Is four assault rockets normal? Because I swear last yes. time I only had three or two. Or maybe it's just because I was completely knocked out that I never get to use them. You never got to use them because they're only forward firing, remember? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and four assault rockets. Four, yeah, four assault rockets. And um, the laser battery is 1d10, and the assault rocket's 2d10 plus 4? That's correct. Um, the, um, the general, the general, the general um, skills, uh, assault scouts, um, usually come with a level three pilot, a level one astrogator, which really won't make that much difference, a level two engineer, um, a level three energy uh, energy person, and then a level two rocket and a level two rocket person. Okay. With a ability score of like seventy for the, it, right? Mm, yeah, pretty much. But um, we'll get. I'll give you those. I'll give. Uh, yeah, that, that's more of an interesting than anything else. Um, Did you have yeah. the um, the image for the all the the combat tables? No, I don't. That's the problem. Sorry. But I've got the combat table here. Don't worry. In front of me. I mean, I've got a copy, but I haven't got. I haven't got ready. I haven't got one prepared for you guys. Unfortunately, I didn't even think about it. To tell you the truth. Um. I've got it. For the Leo, yeah, for the Leo. All right, the Leo has got a uh, Leo two, I should say. Um, it's got a, uh, a pilot four, astro three, engineering four, um, rocket two. On the torpedoes, rocket one on the rocket battery, and uh, energy two for the laser cannon. And laser battery. Okay. Who did we replace uh, Max Tabu with? Uh, Lieutenant, uh, uh, Lieutenant Class. And you guys. That's it. So, Matt, those skill levels, the laser cannon was a two, the rocket battery was a one, the laser batteries were two, was a two, and the torpedoes were a two. But then you said the pilot was a four. Yep. And the 
engineering was a four. Okay, so that ups my forward fire bonus. Oh yeah. Yeah 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 yeah. It does. It does indeed. Also ups your DCR and also ups your uh, various other bits and pieces as well. Uh, I think my DCR is the same at seventy plus forty. Yeah, it is. Okay. So the way this works, James. No, your DCR. You, it's a Starship Engineer four this time, right? Who four? Who yeah. Four, four, four. Yeah. Last time you had a three, so you're plus fifty. No. Yeah, last time he had a three with an intelli with a logic of seventy. Doesn't matter. It's 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 what he said, mate. Trust me. Okay. Okay. Leave it at that. Um, where were we? Um, where were we? Where were we? Where were we? You oh, yeah. ask me something. No, I was gonna say, James. The way this the way this works is right. Um, you move. Um. At some point during your movement, the other side will fire at you. Once you finish your movement, you can fire at the other side, and then it happens again, but in reverse, if you know what I mean. Yeah? Yep. And that's, that's one turn. At the end of every third turn, you can uh, roll to repair damage. And when that happens, we will, when we get to that point, I'll explain how that happens, okay? Um, you can accelerate or, de or decelerate up to five hexes per per turn okay ADS. and it's AD, adf um and you can turn one hex per hex entered um up to four times during your movement and if you if you're not moving at all you can sit there and spin yep does that make sense yep all right. Has anyone got any questions? Is the Osprey tweaked in any way, other than having budget crew levels? I would assume not. No, just as you, just as you are. Um, Lieutenant Taby is the same level pilot as um, as um, Cerise. So, Cerise. And James, there's no right-click set to orbit at 15 kilometres option in the context oh, menu. Man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, what's that a reference to? Eve. 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 Yeah, okay. In Eve, the small ships orbit really fast so that they can't get hit by bigger ships, and it's a good way to not die. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, so um, you, you uh, meet the oncoming fleet some uh, 14 hours out from uh, Clarion Station. Um, you guys... The fleet can be traveling anywhere. Sorry. Oh, I've got a burp coming on. Pardon me. There it is. Ah, pardon me. Um, anywhere from um, uh, any speed you like up to a maximum of 25 hexes. Okay. So, Do we know their speed approximately or not? Uh, their speed is uh, their speed is at, at 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 the start with they're starting at fifteen. So what speed do you what speed as a group do you want to start with as a as a baseline? Let's start with ten. Yeah, and the best thing to do is to get in behind them as soon as you can because of their laser cannon and yeah their laser cannon and torpedoes are forward firing and you're more maneuverable than them yep. even i'm more maneuverable than them yeah and but they, concentrate they got, fire i got way more firepower yep. yeah stick together and concentrate fire until the ship is toast all right now listen i have I just dumped those icon. I just dumped those tokens onto the board. The sapphire. That's the formation the sapphire's coming in at. All right. At this stage, um, you guys can position your ships anywhere in that first or second hex line. That you if, guys. If wish. I can make a suggestion, you guys don't have to follow it, but I would stay tight. 
I'd move to the south. I'd engage further from the south. Well, if that ain't going to happen because if you're going south, they'll go south. Yeah, so we initially need to line up. <laughs> Fair enough. It's a good escort position, that actually. And, and then we will dive one way or the other to try to start to outmaneuver them. Mm hmm. Yeah. So how do you know whose ship is whose? Ah, uh, yeah, good question. You just good have question. to try to remember. Now, I've got an idea for that. Just give me a second to see if I can see if this is going to work. I'm just going to take that classic, first. Right? You, you could, could just replace our in individual icons. And drag and drop it onto the map, right? But I don't know about uh, the new one. Yeah, it does work. Good. Let me reposition these for you. Oh yeah. It's only it's I'm only pulling up the combat tracker to get the names on the system. That's all. I didn't. I don't know. I didn't think of this earlier. There we go. Ah, uh, time. Who am I missing? Oh, the wasp. Okay. So if you hover, if you hover your mouse over, um, you should see the ship names. Yeah. Yep. All right. I won't bother naming. Oh, but yeah, better. And Babu's got Swallow, right? Yep. Uh, no, Babu has Flitter. Sorry, Flitter. I'm going to recommend Osprey goes to the rear Flitter. echelon. Swap, <laughs> swap, swap with the Wasp. Wasp can go up front. Yeah, the tokens are locked currently. But... Are they? Gotcha. Shouldn't be. Try that. I, Still locked? Yeah, this I can't even move them or adjust their size. When you click the mouse button, you can move the map, but you can't move the tokens. Top right oh. corner, there's an unlock icon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Try that. How's that? No. Oh. Uh, did you? Do you have try party, that? You turn. Go to the option to turn on party vision and movement. Uh, I, I really do not like this new system. Because we don't own because we don't own those characters. Yeah, that's right. That's why you got to have party vision or party movement on. Now, where's that? You see options, 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 options. Where's the options? Oh, the option is in settings. Yeah. Uh, dash menu. Uh, auto move. Turn auto center map. Combat, combat, combat. Hang on. It's under token GM. It's the third. Yeah, I'm, I'm work. I'm just working my way down the list. Yep. Facing indicator, party vision and movement. There we go. Try that now. Yep. That got it. All right. Oh, the Osprey just disappeared. Oh, it's back. It's back. 
Um, Yeah, I've named the I've named the um, South Ash ships too. If you're interested. Deathwind, Devastator, and Vampire. Mm -hmm. Right. So I don't think I'm going to need that anymore. Now I've got that one. Right. Where were we? Um, so, um, who hasn't got the map up? Vogue. Or have you? No, I have the map up. Mm, it's not usually not showing on my thing. Uh, anyway, doesn't matter. Or is it you, Sarisa? Well, no, doesn't matter. Okay, I've got so mine's that's background. Oh, is that why? Okay, so that's um, so that's the that's the ships. Is that where you guys are? Um, that's how you want to come in. Yep. That's how we're starting. All right, and you're at speed ten. Yep. And these guys are at speed fifteen. Okay. Somebody, one person, roll me a d10 for initiative. We both rolled the same number. Roll again. Okay, you guys go first. You guys got first movement. I don't like that. Well, you're stuck with it. So you're at speed 10, so... I'm assuming you turned before you did that. That's two turns. Yep. So that would be two turns. I would suggest mm -hmm. you guys all keep roughly that same formation around me. Um, you, the first one, may, the the wasp might want to be one back, but it's up to you guys. And count, you'll have to accelerate. Some of you might have to accelerate, might have to slow. I'm not sure. Nah, it was the same. As Actually, long I as guess you won't. As long as you stay in yeah. the same position. But the Ospreys would have to speed up a bit. Yeah. And the, for whatever reason, the uh, pointers are double length. I noticed that last time on this map. Sound muted, Matt. Do you guys want to fire? I don't think you can. I think you're out of yeah, range. We're out of range. You? All right, give me a sec. I'll get these guys moving. Probably better to fire on the defensive side anyway. Kind of is. Uh, you as long as they don't get torpedoes off at us. What's the movement? 15. Damn it. Oh, hang on a sec.
Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Just insert another map. Yeah, that's all right. It's just easier doing it this way. For me, anyway. That's what I want. Right. Okay. And I think he can go there. He can. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, do you guys want a defensive fire at any point? Yeah, the they're out of range. Lost, can. Just barely. Oh, yeah. You're at nine. Minus squared, 45. So it's, yeah, it's a difficult shot, but it's possible. Yeah, you might as well take it. All right, hang on. So, um, it's at minus 45. Yeah, that's going to miss. That was you, Cat, was it? Yeah, that was the, the wasp. That was the wasp. wasp. Okay, who and the flitter is being controlled by James. James. Yep. So James, um, using your laser battery um, against the reflective hull, um, you've got about a fifteen. Fifteen. Five. At the moment, I think. Yeah, five. Yeah. 5% chance of hitting. And so who are you aiming at first? Which are the which are those two um, destroyers? The Devastator or the Vampire? Thinking, thinking. I'll go for the Devastator. All right. And you need to die 100. Yeah, do you want to I'll dice, yeah. Uh, no, that's going to miss. Uh -huh. These guys, do I, have, I do have them for these guys. Ah, uh, energies. I mean, so I've got. To, it looks like I've got the same chance of hitting you. I may as well take. May as well take it. Doesn't hurt. So uh, this is on the flitter, and then the wasp. So the flitter. It's a miss. And the wasp is a miss. Pardon me. Do I want to launch a torpedo at you? Torpedo range is four. No, I don't. <laughs> Thank go you. for it. Launch I was just, I was just, I was just looking. I was just looking that up. It would get me to it. So, uh, cannon's the only thing with the range. So, um, turn two. All right, so I want It's annoying, that, isn't it? There you go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I'm backwards. You're, you're backwards. Yeah, oh, I am. Oh, bugger. I thought, great, I'm going to up the kilt shot. So you want you want to be within a range of four, and you want to be facing him either directly on or he's one row off. Um, yeah, and you probably don't want to be any closer. Yeah, you guys can do something like that. So where the wasp is there, that was that I didn't have to. That was the, where I could get to without accelerating. That's right. Or decelerating. Right. Or decelerating. Um, I can hit, that is no penalties, can hit it with assault rockets, right? Yeah, no but no benefit or penalty. Cool. Well, uh, you have forward fire. Whatever that is. Uh, yeah, but it's, it's, center line. It's, it's not in the center line, no. I'm it's got to be in the center line to pick up the bonus. Hang on, slow, hang on, slow down. All right. uh, you so, want to be closer than that. The flitter wants to be closer than that. You need to be next to me on one side or the other. 
Your assault rockets only have a range of four. All right. Well, knowing that, I probably would accelerate to eleven and All get right. an extra. Sp right. So you've gone to eleven, Ben. Yep. Recorded. And, and what I, about I, and now the other guys? Have you? If you've changed uh, the speed, you need to. Babu has to go to eleven. All right. Get that extra hex. Uh huh. I'm at the Osprey's at eight. The Osprey's at eight. And the Swallows at nine. Is that right? Mm -hmm. And the Leo's and the Leo's still at ten. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Given that so, I moved an extra space, if I turned there, which I still have a turn to go, would I get my bonus? No. You'd have it's to be you end up. It's, it's on the direct line. It's got to be on the direct line. So you'd have to be in that hex there. You could be in front of the Leo if you want, but... Yeah, okay. So are you going in front of the Leo or not? Why not? Okay. Well, you have to. That, that's going to give you have to give you an extra point of speed, isn't it? No. Because uh, I'd be moving one less to the right. Oh yeah, that's right. You would be too. That's cool. All right. So that's is that where wants everybody wants to end up? Yeah. I don't want to be wasting these rockets. They're hard enough to hit as it is. <laughs> yeah, but you don't want to be close enough for him to unload on you with the yeah. of fire. Yeah. Uh, speaking of which. No one's going to get blown up either way. Oh, don't be like that. As long as it's not the Osprey, and it would be better if it wasn't the frigate. Yes. Um, I can't. Dan, you've played. You've played this particular battle game more than I have. Can you remember if the rocket batteries can fire defensively? I don't think they can. Can they? Yes, they can. And they can. Okay. Yeah. And the laser batteries and the electron batteries can all fire defensively. Correct. Assault rockets and torpedoes cannot. Yeah, and laser cannon obviously because you're not in the full, and laser cannons can't either. Uh, laser cannons can. Can they? What? Yeah. You sure? The only thing that's moving player only are torpedoes and assault rockets. Okay. Oh wait, I, I, I can't turn anyway, and you didn't cross my field of fire, so I can't use the laser cannon. Okay, so um, they're going out, they're going for a quick kill, and they're going for a quick kill on the closest thing, which is the wasp. So that'll be a rocket battery and a laser battery and an electron battery all at the wasp. At least I soaked up some damage from the frigate. Yeah, I was, I was wondering why you wanted to go in front, but you know. Uh, so I got the it. Frig go. The frigate blew up way too soon in the previous one, and it's got more firepower than me. So. <laughs> well, yeah, techni technically, that's the job of an escort ship: is to take out, is to soak the damage up and keep the main ship alive. Yes. So you can um, apply minus 15 to his rocket battery attack, but that means next turn when you move, every square you move into, you have to turn for the first four turns. First four hexes. Yeah, for the first four hexes, you have to turn every hex. So if you want to dodge, you can do that. Yeah, that, that feels like what I would be doing anyway, so... All right. Well, well, okay. If you want to declare a dodge, and that's fine. Yeah. Um, boy, and by the way, I forgot about that. Thank you, Dan. Um, then, yeah. Just but note on your just note on your shit. You've got to turn every hex. All right. For the first four hexes. Until you run out of MR. Yeah. Okay. So you can turn left and then right and then left and right or left, 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 left or right, right, right or any other combination you like. But you've got to turn four times in the first four hexes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So. Um, let's run down this list. The laser battery against you against reflective hull. Um, and you guys might want to drop a D100 onto your hot key bar. Yeah, maybe. Which is not a bad idea, actually. Why didn't I think of that? Yeah, I mean, my hot bar reads D100, D10, 2D10 plus 4. <laughs> Okay, um, so the laser battery hits, um, and I need to work out where it hits. It's going to hit on the, um, 
Laser battery, laser battery, laser battery, laser battery. Uh, it's a hull hit, a normal hull hit. Sorry, I hit that by mistake. That's cool. Uh, for two two hull points, um, um, Dan, uh, Ben. Uh, Shit, two hull hits, uh, and the uh, assault scanner has fifteen, right? That's fifteen, yeah. So you're down to thirteen at the moment. That was the that was the laser battery. The electron beam uh, has a slightly less chance to hit, but does more damage from memory. Oh, and that's not forward firing. Uh, no, that, it no, does. It battery. has a bonus to the uh, damage table. Yeah, is oh, that what it is? Yeah, okay. It's plus ten. Wait, yeah. disruptor beam cannon? No, electron beam battery. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything with a battery in it's got a is uh, a turret is turreted. Yeah. Uh, it misses, by the way. Well, that is shockingly bad roll. Um, I better mark off the rocket battery now. That's the that's the death wind. Rocket one. Defensive straight. Did you want to use your ICM? I'm the only one with ICM now. I'm asking. Nope. Okay. Not to save the wasp. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, and it looks like the rockets, yeah, the rocket batteries missed you as well. So just the two hull points for you. Um, uh, feel free to open fire. <laughs> All right, well, we'll do the wasp, then the frigate, and then we'll do kind of in the order we are. Yeah, okay, so I'll go laser battery first. Laser battery, you've got a 40, you've got a 50% chance, hang on, 50, 40, uh, 30. Uh, well, that's enough. <laughs> yeah. Because it, it drops 5% per hex, so it's minus 10. Um, so uh, percentile for location, 71. 71 lose all screens, all screens and ICMs. And ICMs. Bugger, that's going to make be a problem. Whew. Thank you for taking out his ICMs. That's going to be nasty. Him. <laughs> uh, now, now the assault rocket. The assault rocket. Uh, assault rocket. That was sixty percent. Um, yeah, for you it would be sixty percent. So that's a hit with the assault rocket. So minus, minus ten. 10. 70 yeah. weapon hit laser yeah. battery. Laser battery. What's the laser battery? Destro hang on. Destroyed. Whoops. Laser battery. That's a pain in the butt. Don't like you. Don't like you at all. All right. Three uh, assault rockets. Yep. Done. Pretty good. I'm uh, not going to fire a torpedo. I think we're going to, between this and defensive fire, I'm hoping we wipe him out. All right, so let's start with the laser cannon. Mm hmm. Mm, it's a hit. And uh, location is hole. Regular a hole damage hit. to mm -hmm. the or laser cannons, two damage. Two d ten. Think two d ten, yeah. Okay, rocket battery. Uh, hang on, I'm gonna mark that Is off. Is he dodging? No, he's not dodging. Actually, you have to have. I think the only fighters and assault scouts can dodge. Yeah, they can. <laughs> right. I think Corvettes yeah. might be able to as well. I don't remember. And then we have to add a minus 10 to this mm -hmm. for location. Take, yeah. That's a 16, which is still a hull hit. Which I think is, again, 2d10. Mm -hmm. Yep. There we go. Okay. Um, so 11. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. And the laser battery. Yep, okay. 
Yes. That. Uh, I've got two skill levels, so that's against a reflective hull. Forty. No, that's not. Two that's, skill and then a no, that's, diffusion of three. It's the, it, no, it, yeah, that's not enough. Yeah. Okay. And okay. I am done. And you are done. Let's do the osprey next. Okay. Who's who's got the osprey? Laser. Laser. Nope. Not with the range diffusion. Okay, we're holding off on the uh, disposals. rocket. Yep. Okay. That's the osprey. Uh, that was. So who's next? Wasp. Oh, no, it's what's Flitter or Swallow? Flitter. Do the Swallow. Do the, no, do the swallow you not firing this. with your assault rockets? No. Well, the Osprey's holding off on them. Okay. Well, the Osprey was holding off on the torpedo, not the assault, assault rocket. Rockets. Yeah, that's what I meant. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. Well, you guys well, don't have torpedoes. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Slow down. Let's slow down. Let's... Ryan, yep. was that your laser battery? Assault rockets. That was your assault rockets. Okay. So, location on the assault rocket? It's D100. Uh, 51. Assault. Drive mm. it. Lose half you take out the 10? Uh, yeah. Round up. Mm -hmm. Nasty. Uh, hang on. Hang on. Slow down. ADF, 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 ADF was three. So, it's down to one. Should have used torpedoes. And this is laser. Right. Misses. Okay. And finally, the wasp. Uh, no, no, finally, no. the osprey. Uh, one, two, three, four. It's minus 20%. Off that so the laser battery hit is going to be. Um, What's your beam weapon? Who's got beam weapons? On, who's running the beam beam weapons on the Osprey? Nobody. Nobody. Okay. Uh, so you've got a thirty. Did I say four, five, one, two, three, four? That's minus twenty. You've got a ten percent chance to hit with the laser battery. Babu. Wait a minute. The Osprey is dark. Uh, yeah. And... Uh, Sorry. The flitter is flitter. I meant the flitter. Flitter, the fl flitter would One, be normal. Two, three, four. So the, yeah, okay. So it's a fifty. It's a. Um, uh, hang on. No, it's not. Give me a sec. Hang on. Twenty. Uh, to thirty percent chance. This is the ship's battery. Yeah, this is the laser battery. 30% chance. No. Uh, the rockets would give you, uh, if you were to use the rockets, um, your assault rockets would be um, sixty percent chance to hit. Did sixty or fifty? Six. Six. 60, six zero. If you were to use them, you don't have to, but you've and you've only got four of them, don't forget. There's only three enemies. <laughs> One way of looking at it. I only have two torpedoes. Mm -hmm. I give it a shot. See if we okay. Can yeah, there's only a six percent difference between not firing it in the center line and firing it in the center line. So. Yeah. And given how deadly this combat is, it's it really it's fire it, first. Yeah, it <laughs> combat. is. You can get blown. Yeah. You're, we're fighting destroyers. You have 15 hull points. If they unload their full battery on you and they hit with most, you're dead. Yep, that's the way it goes. Um, so that's so, uh, that's that's a hit. So I need you to roll me two dice. Plus four. Uh, no, no, no. I need like I need a location first, which is percent off. Percent off. Yep. Uh, that's rockets. another 52. Uh, two. You have uh, no which, ADF. Oh, damn it. I can't change. I can't, I, can't, I, can cha I can't change speed. You hit the engine, so I can't change speed. 
Um, right, so I'm stuck at 15. Okay, all good. Is that everybody? Yep. Okay. And if I can make a suggestion before you bother to move him, well, actually, no, you'll you'll move him so we know defensive fire, what the minimum range is. Yeah, pretty much what it is now, unless I do something stupid. Well, it's a matter of if you turn towards us or away from us, because some of us can get a better shot. Yes, I know. Um, so look, let me let me let me do this first. Okay. So first, we get attacked in the rear. R.I.P. Osprey. Possibly. Damn it. I couldn't slow down in time. Gee, it's not right. That's that one. What's, what's their MR? Two? Uh, three, actually. Are they three, uh, three? Yeah, uh, four, three, I think you'll find. Hang on. Four, uh, yeah, three, three. So how does, how does acceleration and deceleration work? It means if you have an ADF of five, you can accelerate five in a turn. And it doesn't matter. Yeah, accelerate or decelerate by that number. And there's no number of squares that the acceleration has to happen over, right? Well, it happens no. over the entire turn, so it just yeah. happens. Gotcha. It just happens. So um, now, hang on a sec. Um, I've got a funny feeling we're going to have to do this. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Damn it. Okay. <sighs> Oops. Okay. Right. <laughs> I'm going to take my to... defensive fire on the ship right on top of me. <laughs> Uh, well, that's actually behind you, so yeah, you can do it with the battery, yes. On the vampire. And then, all right, hang on. Sorry, not... uh, you... sorry, what was that? Okay. You right? Okay. Hang on, just hold on a split second before you do anything else. Um... Okay. All right. So um, let's let's go down the list. Let's do the Leo first, then we'll do the, do the, do the down the. Why is the uh, death wind so far away from us? Because it's got a movement of fifteen. He's got a yeah. His speed is fifteen. He he turned down. Yeah. That's why he moved everybody on the map. Gotcha. That's why I moved everybody up the map so because I, I knew I was going to go down and around. Actually, for that matter, I've got a movement left, so I've got a maneuver left, I should say. So hang on a sec, because I can. So yeah, I guess. Why can't I? Why won't he? Why won't he rotate? Shift. Shift. Yeah, I'm holding the shift down. And you, you, you resolve the defensive fire 
at, the at end any of point their move, or no at, at, any, at any point at any point in their movement you can also right click i think that works for uh yeah it does no it, it, it something's locked up anyway um the he's facing up the map to to the northwest all right i can't yeah he's facing that way thank you so um let's uh, so uh, leo you know we're gonna you who you you're gonna be firing at whom uh, the death wind the death wind well, and you're going to be fire, you're going to be firing at um your range four it was his closest no he was in that heads right there sorry yeah, you're right he was range three from me range three for you it's range four for so the others. laser cannon okay Missed. Uh, rocket battery. Oh, wait. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, it's a miss. Um, and laser battery. Uh -huh. That's a miss. Well done. All right. Wasp. Uh, well, yeah. Okay. Wasp. Yep. Ben, that's you. Yep. Uh... I was too away from it, uh, yeah. so yeah, I'll go as much as I'm tempted to hit one of the ones coming up to us, I'll hit the, the death wind. Okay, well, with what? Yeah. A laser battery. It's laser the battery? I, it's yeah, the only yeah, thing yeah. I have. Yeah. Okay. That's, That's a miss. A miss. The, vampire, the, the, the death, wind, death wind may survive. <laughs> okay. Um, the, uh, the flitter, James? Yep. That's the you, you're gonna if you're gonna so, use your laser battery. Okay. If you're gonna if you're gonna use your laser battery. Uh still a still a uh, still a thirty percent chance. Uh be against a vampire. Yeah uh, against a vampire, sorry. Well you can either uh, hit the death wind where it was or you can attack one of the ships coming up on us. You're just going to have the best chance to hit the vampire. Yeah, you are. You've, if, you're going, if you're going after the vampire, you've got a um, a, a forty five percent chance hit, a chance of hitting. All right, I go against the vampire. Okay. Uh, nope, nope, that's a miss. Okay, so the, uh, the, that's the swallow. Yeah, I'll shoot the vampire. Mm-hmm. That's a hit in the hole. Hole for oh, that's gone off the board. My board owners didn't see that. Thank you. One a point. <laughs> hey, it all helps. Maybe not. Oh, apparently, I rolled twice. Uh, um, and uh, finally, the osprey. Yep. And again, just for clarification, lasers are always first with the osprey. We're firing at the vampire. You find the vampire, okay? Oh, okay. That's a miss. You can't fire your assault rockets as uh, defensive. Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. So that's that one. All right, so offensive fire. Um, I can't hit you with the um, with the, with the death wing. Um, the vampire is going to be hitting, shooting at the swallow with everything it's got. I might die first again. Yeah, maybe. Got a, I've got bad luck, apparently. Mm. Laser cannon. Point blank range. That's a hit. For no change with the cannon, is it? No. Uh, it's a weapon hit. Laser battery. Okay. I just Ooh, got that sucks. Mm. Um, the that was a la so the next one is the vampire's laser battery. Uh, that's a hit. In the twenty-three, which is a hull hit. Mm-hmm. 
And seven points. All right. Um, the electron beam a battery. Uh, no, that's a miss. Aren't you lucky? Uh, and the first of its rocket batteries. Now, why not? Because we can. Uh, that's going to be close. No, that's a hit. Minus 10 on your... Ah! Uh, you don't have any screens or ICM, so that translates to a hull hit. Rocket batteries D10 from memory, isn't it? 2D10. 2D10. Oh, nasty. Oops, hang on. First one, not second. GG. Yeah, actually, you're, you're probably one. It was the second. The second one was a six. The first one was a 20. I have one hit point. How do you have one hit point? Because you a did 20. seven and then six. Or is it? are you doing the 20? Oh, uh, it's the 20 is the first one I rolled. Oh, the 20 is the first one? Yeah, then I'm dead. Uh, yeah, that's what I thought. GG. GG, GG. <laughs> Same thing um, going to happen. I to died the in the second round of combat this time. You know, I got farther. Did I? <laughs> I believe so. I did. I did. I didn't die in the first round. I died in the second this time. Uh, all right. And the Devastator. This is why you fire everything at all times. Yeah. No, <laughs> yeah. no holding back. And probably defensive fire at the thing firing at you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you had a, it, it, I mean, the Deathwing's uh, been hit a few times. It's not, it's not heavily damaged at all. All right. So the Devastator at the Osprey. Uh, it's a miss with the uh, cannon. Everybody got their next miss character. Miss with the laser up, battery. Re hey. I'm like, does everybody have their next character ready to reroll? Yeah, I don't know about <laughs> that. I don't know about that, mate. Um, nice battery, electron beam battery. Oh, hey, I had a torpedo lift too. I'm going to use that in a second. Um, that's a hit with the rocket battery. Uh, electron beam battery. What am I saying? Um, uh, it's a weapon hit. Torpedo don't have. Assault rockets. Yes, you do. The Osprey has no assault rockets left. Oh, ouch. Well, still got the laser battery. <laughs> Yay. Uh, and finally, uh, 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 the rocket, the what's his rocket battery? Oh, that's a miss. Uh, and the torpedo is going in on the Leo. Oh, that's a miss. And the vampire's torpedo is going in on the Leo. That's a miss. Son of a miss. That's everybody. Turn three, your movement, guys. So you're done. It's our turn? Yeah. Uh, when I... You turn when you into a square i'm trying to figure out the rules for you, you me having to turn, turn. In the, yeah you can't turn in the square you start in but each you can turn one facing each square you you move. gotcha yeah. so i have to move forward one then turn forward yes. one then turn forward one then turn forward one, then yeah turn. okay right. gotcha you guys probably want to accelerate i'm going to try to get forward fire back on these guys i'm going to figure out how i can do that <laughs> Well, why do you think I split? Uh, you got to move first. Before, you got to oh, you got to move first before you turn. Oh, I did. One, two, three, four. Yeah, assuming, assuming you're not accelerating or decelerating, or are you accelerating? Hang on, guy. We're, 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 we're keeping the same speeds or not? I'm accelerating. Accelerating to thirteen. Okay, thank you. I'm going to it. That was you in the Osprey. 
Right. Um, Wasp, what are you doing? Accelerating or? Uh, well, I could accelerate to 16 if I wanted you to. You could. Uh, for a turn that I have to keep. So I, I only have to keep turning until I run out of MR, right? That's correct. All right. So let's let's think with my brain. Yep. Okay. Well, let me know if you're going to accelerate or decelerate before you start moving, please. Uh, well, yeah, I have to. I'm so unused to this movement that I have to think mm. about it before I. No, do that's it. cool. That's okay. Uh, and I guess with these movements, is there any kind of coordination between us before we start moving? Like. Well, apparently not, because the osprey's got the osprey's gone way out to the to the um, right. Yeah. Okay. Uh... Um. So, I mean, you guys, if you guys want to maneuver in the same direction, that's up to you guys. But each ship is technically independent. Technically is independent. Yeah. And I guess you would prefer us. But to... I just decided to take some initiative. Mm, that's cool. Uh, and I guess uh, you would prefer it if we would stay on the map, right? Uh, well, I can move the map around. But it's all right. So, yeah. yeah. Uh, so, uh, Dan, did you have a particular target that you were going for this round? Uh, the vampire. I'm, I'm going to put myself where that green circle is, aiming right at him. I don't know how you can do that. That's easy. I, see, Ken, I can see it. Yeah, I can see it. I just traced it out. Right. And I'm yeah, I, I said, I, uh, yeah. So what are you accelerating to, Dan? 13. 13. Well, you go, go ahead and move then, Dan. James, what about you? Where are you thinking about going? Hang on. Move forward, turn. Move forward, turn. I don't see how you can get to there, that direct, that facing that direction, mate. I honestly don't. Are you talking to me? Yeah. You gotta move forward you gotta you gotta move forward there to turn. Move forward ah, to there. Turn. Uh, yep, yeah, you're right, you're right. You can you can uh, be you can be you can be you can, wrong. Yeah, you can get to there. You can get to there but you can't turn to there. Yeah, no, I, I, I you're right. Um I gotta figure uh refigure it out that case. <laughs> So, that's where I'm going to want to, uh, no, I need to be one back from that. Um, hold on. And you've got to move um, 13, 13 hexes. Do you have to move your MR before no. you can turn? No, 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 or no, no. you no. just have to move one hex? And you can only turn up to the number of turns based on your MR. Yeah. You can you can only turn one hex side per hex you move into. And you can only turn a maximum of your MR in any one movement. Okay. Did you change your mind and you're going after the death wing? You... Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. I I can I can make a U turn and get back over to Oh. Is that your dog, Ben? Not mine. Yes, we're the toy. I could get to here, right? Facing that way. Um but then they're both gonna Well, eh, then they're both gonna circle and come behind me. But you guys should not stick with me. Don't stick with me. You have more maneuverability. You can get behind them. 
and forward fire on them. Well, the problem is that I can't because I'm dodging. Right. Well, you can dodge in a circle. <laughs> well, you could. Um, uh, Dan. Yeah. Hang on. Yeah. If you came, if you came down that line from there, shouldn't you be one hex further over to the right? Shouldn't you be in that? Uh, oh, you're right. You should be in that hex there. Yeah. That's all right. Which, um, hold on. That's not where I want to go either then. Because <laughs> then I don't get forward fire. All right. Well, the best you can do, if you start in, if you start, hang on, just don't move. If you start, uh, if you start there, all right. The first, the, you've got to go into where the hex the wasp is in before you can turn left or right. Yep, yep. No, I know. Yeah, okay, good. Just making sure we're on the same page. Yeah, uh, I'll, I will come down after this guy. I can get him with a torpedo. I won't have forward fire on him, but... Okay. Yeah, I won't have my rocket battery on him, but well, you have no rocket battery. Yeah. Right? No. No. No, it's just outside the forward firing line. Now, and that um, that's thirteen hexes. One, yeah. two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Right, so that's where you're going. Okay, that's where the osprey is going. Um, the flitter needs to move, and the wasp needs to move. One. Got to turn one way or the other, left or right. Shit, hang on. <laughs> You're going that way. Well, okay, that's your first move. All right. Two. Got to turn again. Left or right. Okay. Three. Third turn. Left or right. Okay, move forward and then left or right again for your fourth one. Okay. Okay. And you've uh, you, uh, you, uh, you, ha you haven't changed speed, you said, yes? Hang on. Uh, yeah, so that's four. So I'd have, uh, what would that be? Six, seven more square, squares to go. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That one there. Okay. And finally, the flitter. Babu. That dodge yeah. really kind of sucks. Okay. So. Getting... Oh, that gets you. Gets you. Ready to intercept Not this guy if you come through. What I'm doing, but mm -hmm. I will try to do this. Well, you've got to move forward one hex to start with. So do it hex by hex. There's one. Now you can two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> uh, eight. Okay, you can't. Eight, nine, ten, and one more square is eleven. I can't turn again. You only turn up to four times. You've already turned four times. Oh no, you haven't. That's your fourth turn. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah. And then one, and then one foot. They say you're at speed eleven, aren't you? Yep. Yep. So that's where you end up. Oh, well done. Nicely, nicely positioned. Yep. Okay, so that's everybody's movement. All right, um, these guys, the, these guys are going to the devastator and the vampire are going to fire at the closest approach, which was one hex. Okay, um, so uh, the vampire on the frigate, Leo, with with laser battery, that's a hit. 
That's a double penetration hit, double hull hit. Uh, 10 points of hull damage on the frigate. Um, the electron beam on the frigate is a miss. Um, I can't fire the torpedo. And I'm going to keep the rocket battery. I've only got a limited amount of those. So I'm going to keep those. Um, the Devastator. There's a battery on the... Oh, it's another hit on the Os that's another hit on the Osprey. Uh, it's a hull hit on the Osprey. How many hull points has the Osprey taken? You haven't taken any, have you? You've taken a, a battery hit, haven't you? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, ten hull hits, mate. Ten hull points. Uh, electron beam. Ah, missed. Um, I'm going to keep the rocket battery up my sleeve on that one as well. Uh, the Death Wing hasn't got a laser battery because you destroyed it on me. So he's going to yeah, fire at the Yeah, and I took all your ADF too. Yeah, 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 yeah. And the, so, so that's a, uh, a let's say uh, electron beam at the frigate. That's a hit. Um, uh, it's a weapon hit. Um, photon beam, electron beam, laser battery. On the frigate. Yeah, that's the laser what, battery. What was that uh, order again? The laser battery? Yeah, laser battery is the first one. Yeah, because that's the first one you're going to affect. It's you. a 63 to 64, right? Yeah, that's right. Uh, and what else do I have up my sleeve? Um, yeah, I mean, he's, he's going to fire. He's, he's going to fire another. He's going to fire a rocket battery at you as well, um, which is the second rocket I'm using for him. Oh God, that's a miss. And I don't have a laser battery because you destroyed it. And from being fired, remember fired. Okay, that's everything on him. So that's all the defensive fire, offensive fire. Um, let's do the frigate first. I don't think anyone else is in range, are they? Apart from apart from um, the flitter. The flitter. So I will two, start three, with torpedo. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, everything else is out of range. Torpedo. Okay. Yeah, I had a choice between decelerating or not shooting this round, and I chose <laughs> not shooting this round. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Um, Minus 20 to this. Yep. Yeah. That's double damage. <laughs> That's a double That's hit. Double damage. 40, 10. Do you want to just double the number, or do you want me to roll eight dice? No, I double it. Just double the number. Just roll it and double the number. This could be nasty. Could be, but isn't. I haven't seen the roll yet. Uh, 15 double. Oh, there it is. Just, just came up. Yeah. 15. So, Ooh, he's heavily, uh, heavily damaged. Heavily damaged, that ship. Heavily, heavily damaged. Yeah. And um, that's all. I'm done. That's all you're done. Okay. Um, in that case. The flitter. I'm assuming it's the vampire. Yeah. Uh, head on shot with the rocket battery, yeah? Yeah. With the, with the assault rockets, I should say. Now, knock off an assault rocket off your off your total because yep. you've only got a limited number. And hit me. Well, don't, yeah, well, hit me. Hit me with your rhythm stick. Now. Oh, <laughs> nice. Very nice. Then have very, one more D100. Very nice. so D100. Yeah. D100 for location. 
Minus 10 standard hole. 24, there. and so standard damage, which was, uh, what did we say? 2D 10 plus 4, isn't it? Yep, 2D 10 plus 4. 2D so 10 there's, plus 4. There's, there's no bonus for rolling a crit on the 2 hit. Not on no. the 2 hit, no. No, but there's no critical not, fail. Not, you not, just, you but know. there's no critical fail either. Gotcha. So. Um, it's all about the the location for the for starship. That was on the vampire, wasn't it? Yes. Yeah. Okay. That's that one. Um. So that was your assault rockets. I'm assuming you use your laser battery on it as well. Since it's still there, yes. Okay. So you're looking at um. Where are we? Laser battery. You're looking at a 35 percent chance to hit with uh with that. Uh, no, unfortunately, no, that's a miss. Are we so doing... that's everybody's... Sorry, go on. Yeah, we, we are, but it's not the end of the turn yet. Well, no, are we we'll doing... Do um, when you're more than half damage, you have a chance to break apart? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I've been working... I, I, it's, only, it's, only, it's only just happened this round that we've gone over half damage for two of the ships. So, so if you use maneuverability or acceleration. Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out for the Osprey because my bonus is in what. Yeah. Okay. Next so, round is our repair round. Uh, end of this round, actually, before we before you guys get to move. Gotcha. Okay, and I've got to move fifteen. So one, two, three, four, five. Damn it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, yes. Okay. So, whoopsie daisy. I, oh, I hoped it was good. Oh, I was trying to. Distract the Death Wing to not shoot at the Osprey. Yes. Well, unfortunately, I unfortunately I was going to overshoot, and I, and I want to use my and I want to use my forward cannon, so I can on the Osprey. Yeah, fair. I, I'm not faulting this logic. I'm just was oh, no. that we yeah, I, that yeah, we no. weren't getting blown up. Yeah. <laughs> I, well, I I haven't hit you yet. Yes. And you guys get to fire at you, or everybody who can can get to fire at me. The closest point of approach is two in front of the os is zero in front of the Osprey, effectively. And, and two one, two, three, four, four in front of you, or one, two, three in front of you. Depends if you want to use your forward firing weapon or not. Oh, I don't have one. Oh, you don't have I one. Just, just have the, well, I the, I can't use the rocket, the assault rockets as defensive, right? No, you can't. Correct. So it's just so, my uh, one, laser two, battery, which I'll roll. Which now. is still, which is still four. Hang on, I haven't finished moving yet. What? I haven't finished moving. Yeah. Move the others. I'm going to move the other ships yet. All right. One. Oh, no, hang, hang, hang on, hang on, hang on. I've also, I've also got to, hang on. Got to see if you see. destroy yourself. Yeah, I just rolled a 97. Yeah, we don't die this round. The Deathwing died. Your engineer sucks. Well, I didn't get a chance. To, I didn't. I rolled a ninety-seven. What can you do when you roll a ninety-seven? <laughs> I know. There's not much you can do. Uh, okay, so one, and Doc, don't worry. With folks' engineering skills, two, you don't have a chance of destroying the ship. Three, I'm just that good. Uh, if you used all nine points, I bet you would. Uh, uh that's twenty-seven, and I'm exactly twenty-seven. Oh, nice. Okay, so he came back. He basically, whoops, hang on. He basically came in on shit. He ba shit. He basically came in along that line from yeah, you know, from there. So two, two for you, two for the wasp, and one for the uh, for the osprey at, at its closest. If you if you're wondering. Oh, so the speed is now thirteen. Uh, no, speed's only eleven. Okay. It's, it's still only it's still only eleven to get to him. Three, four, 
Oh, I can do the same thing to you too. Again, coming in along that line. If you guys survive, get behind them and they can never get you in their forward firing arc again. You're assuming I don't manage to um, stuff up your maneuverability. Okay, defensive, yeah. fi defensive fire. Look, um, the flitter, um, if you're firing at the vampire, you're at range four. Yeah, one over, right. actually. Well, they were next to each other, so they could, whoever's got those two marked. It was like uh, that. It was three from the flitter. All right. So if you're firing at the vampire, it was a, a range three uh, defensive okay. fire for the flitter. So um, that was a 35%, 35% chance to hit with the laser battery. You can't use your assault rockets. Right. All right. Laser battery. Mm hmm Nope. Okay. Um, you, can you, you can't get them at all, can you? Can you, uh, The Dave? frigate has a 1, 5% chance. Oh, well, you might as well if you want to take it. It's range of 9 on the vampire. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, it is 2. 9 to the vampire. One sec. Where's your father? He's with the dog. I'll roll for him. <laughs> No, and aren't you glad you don't have any critical fails? Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, Wasp, do you want to fire at the Devastator or the Vampire? The Vampire. It's a hit. Location, duty 10. That no, did percentile, sorry. 66. Sits, sits is weapon hit DC at laser cannon. DC. Oh, DC LC. But DC's yeah, DC. disruptor cannon. Cannon, yeah. So LC's laser cannon. That's a pain in the butt. I was going to, that's why I line, lined you up so I could get you on the laser cannon. It's a very good one to disable. Good, good. It has a higher hit chance than the laser battery and does more damage to it. Mm -hmm. But it's only forward firing. Yeah. Okay. Um, do you have you have you has, has the Osprey still got its laser battery? Yes. And then you want to fight? Do you, are you want to fight the Devastator? Is it a zero sum game? I can choose to keep it for defensive or use it up as offensive. No, what, you have fire laser, the, the laser battery you can do both. Okay, no, we'll sh shoot at our tail. <laughs> okay, that's a hit. Like D percentile for location. 85. Combat, Combat control. control system. Minus 10 and all hits. Son of a bitch. Nice one. That's going to make it more difficult to hit you. Okay. So that's all the defensive fire. Let's do the offensive fire. Um, we'll do the vampire first. You know, I don't have my laser cannon anymore. So. Laser battery. Missed. Electron beam battery. Missed. <gasps> Not happy, Jan. Rocket battery. Missed. The damn ships um, can't hit you for shit. Hey, Matt, just to make it worse, don't forget to rock mark off that rocket battery. I just did. <laughs> Torpedo! Oh, God. I missed again. I missed everything. Do I need to say it again, Matt? Go away. <laughs> Osprey. Laser cannon. That minus 10 to hit. Okay, who's been playing around with my dice? Somebody has been playing around with my dice. I switched them with mine. That's why you I'm must have done. Now. Laser battery. Oh, for God's sake. Rocket battery. Finally! Finally! 
Okay. Uh, that's an electric, and you've got a uh, rocket battery, rocket battery, rocket battery, rocket battery, rocket battery. Rocket battery, rocket battery. Yeah. It was rocket like, battery's already destroyed. Yeah, no, I, I, just what I was using to hit you with. Is it a combat control? No, it's a one point MR loss. Okay. It's a, it's a one point MR loss. So you, you, the MR is reduced by one. Um, torpedo. Oh, God, I missed you with that, too. I don't know why you weren't so afraid of the bloody sapper for. They can't hit for shit. <laughs> oh, that wasn't your torpedo. Yeah, it was, that was right. Okay, so that's they all my... Own... by clone troopers. Yeah, obviously. No, um, so stormtroopers. Every... Clone troopers Whatever. have good aim. Actually, they don't. Um, that's everybody. That's all the offensive fire. So we do a... We do a damage control. So, uh, Frigate, what how are you going to spend your damage control? I'm going to split it um, 70 points to my laser battery and 40 points to hull repair. Okay. Well, the laser battery first. Nope. Hull repair. Nope. Oof. Oof. Um, yeah. Oof. <laughs> so wasp how are you going to spend yours i got 60 points right 60 points total yeah you split up however you like uh at least 20 points has got to go on one on one thing that's your engineer yeah okay so i have three uh oh i'm a, that mustn't have been right I've, i have three hull damage uh so i will use all of it on that is that any, oh, is that oh, any... Hull repair is 1d10 points yeah. of... If you make it, you get to repair 1d10. If, if you make oh, your yeah, roll, gotcha. if you get your 60% chance, then yeah. you get to you get get roll the 1d10. Is that the, only, is that the only damage you've taken? Yeah, the Wasp has gotten shot to pieces, but hasn't actually gotten any hits on it. It's great. <sighs> All right, so, yeah. So if you make your 60%, if you make your 60 damage... 60 yeah, percent damage roll. I did not. No, no, you do not. You definitely do not. I'm afraid. Okay. Um, the flitter. Have you got any damage? Nope. Uh, none at all. Oh, okay. No. Well, you don't have to do anything then. Um, Osprey. I give okay, you thirty-seven. You the maneuver rating, I think. You want to fix your you want to fix your maneuver rating? You, you don't want to have it. You don't want to fix your hole. All right, well, we've only taken 20% hull damage, but the maneuver rating is... Hang uh, on, hang on. Your hull's only 15. One five, and you've oh, taken 10... Okay, well, we'll fix that then. We'll and you've taken five, 10 oh. points. Yeah, you've taken 10 points, I think. Um, so, yeah, so uh, all your damage control... All your damage control... I heard 5-0, oh, but it's 1-5. Yes. It's 1-5. Yeah, yeah, 1 5 is the demi is the hit hell points on an assault scout. The frigate is 50. Mm. No, frigate's 40, destroyers are 50. Destroyers are 50. Gotcha. Yeah. Uh, so that's you, that's a successful that's a successful roll. You get back eight of those ten points. You're on two hull point damage. Well done. Um, now the remaining ships. Um, where am I? So I've got seventy-five, and my engineer gives me another twenty. So okay. Um, he hasn't taken any damage at all, so that doesn't mean anything. So the vampire, um, to hit all the laser cannon, or I can split it. Or the hull. Um, I think I'll split it down the middle. So. Uh, 
Uh, what's half of 75? 37. 37, 57. Uh, 57 on that one. No. And on that one. Oh, no. Bugger. All right. That's, every, that's everything. So your guys, uh, you, you guys have a movement. Turn. You guys can move and maneuver. So frigate. For movement? Yeah, movement. Okay, so I should... They're at a speed of 16. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, it's three forward. Yeah, 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 yep, 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 yep. At a speed of 16. Okay. You can do it uh, shortest distance and then yeah, just yeah, do it in increments of two. Mm -hmm. um, what about the flipper? What are you doing? And your current speed is uh, 11. You can go up to 16 if you wanted to. Flipper is going after his One, prey. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Uh, 11 to right on the other side of the frigate there, by my, by my calculation, without a speed change. Or... Um, if you're right three, behind four, them, because when they make U-turns, they're three wide. So if you're right behind them, they can't make a U-turn on you. And like, yeah. um, you have to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you want to end where they're in your forward fire arc. So the Osprey wants to end back two, two squares. Speed, two, three, two, three. Which means you'd have to drop your speed to, to 11. To a 9, yeah. To a 9. Okay. <laughs> I, I will never get used to which way I need to scroll Spin. this wheel. Can, can you get the wasp so that he's forward fire on him? I can. I can. Okay. Yeah, I don't know, I'm, I'm working out how. Uh, one, two, three. Can't you turn? Can't you? Hang on. Actually, wait a minute. I worked this out and I had to turn earlier. Yeah, you had to turn the square before, the hex before, which you can do. I just worked it out. So that's where you're in. Now, what's your speed? Uh, my speed was 11, so I end up on top of him. But You, you can drop the speed it, by up to 5. So oh, yeah, I'll drop it by 1 and end up so here. Down to 10. Okay, I don't think that boy's going to be very healthy in a second. No, I don't think so, and that's the name that's of the That's the objective. Game. That's the objective. Okay, is that everybody's movement? Yeah. Oh. Yep. All right, so defensive fire from the vampire. Uh, let's go and see if we take the frigate out. Um, and I've got everything except my laser cannon, which doesn't make a difference in this case. So on the frigate, uh, laser battery. At that range, that's a hit. Um Anyone, 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 anyone more? Um, that's a hull hit. Uh, seven point hull hit on the frigate. Um, electron beam. That's a hull, that's a hit on the uh, that's you got an electric, you got an electrical fire on board oh no on the frigate okay uh rocket battery let's go all out because i'm not gonna survive <laughs> 
<clears throat> That's the vampire, isn't it? Yeah. Well, oh, what am I doing? Hang on. Um, hit the wrong key. That's what's the problem. Right, here we go. Um, num, 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 num. I can't use a torpedo. Bugger. Okay, one, two, three, four. Um, the uh, Devastator is going to be firing at the frigate as well. Laser battery. Hit. Uh, defensive hit. You haven't got any... Oh, you've, you're all, you've lost your ICMs, mate. Dan? Okay, got it. Yep, good. Electron beam. That's a, <laughs> well and truly a miss. Um, that's rocket battery as well. That's a hit with a rocket battery. Uh, minus 10, which makes it a 29, which makes a hull hit anyway. Uh, 2d10 for a rocket, isn't it? Yep. Plus 4. No, no that's not assault no, rocket. rocket battery, not ah. assault rocket. Yeah. Uh, 13 hull points, mate. Yeah, I better knock, I better knock that rocket off as well. Got it. Uh, so that's all that... Sorry? How many hull points does the frigate have left? Uh, you know, not I've any. been counting the wrong way. Hold on. <laughs> it's going to not make a difference. You've only got 40 and you just took at least half that. So I'm down to 10. Mm, okay. Um, okay, so... Um, that's all the defensive fire, so you guys can unload if you want. Uh, frigate first. Torpedo. Mm. <laughs> okay. Yes. 41. Minus 20 hull is hit. a whole hit. That's a whole hit. 41's a whole hit anyway. Yeah. Damage. Wow. Laser cannon. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. So, okay. Uh, right, heavily wound, hev a heavily damaged vampire. Laser cannon, a laser, whatever it was. Don't think so. Oh, well, laser cannon or cannon or back cannon. So I've got forward fire bonus on that as well of twelve. Yeah, in that case, yes, that's a hit. Location. 62 is a weapon uh, hit. Laser cannon, laser bat, laser battery. Laser cannon's gone. Laser battery's gone. Mm, this is getting nasty. Um, anything else you want to shoot at him? Oh, yeah, everything. Um, laser battery uh, and my, rocket battery. No, my laser battery's out. And that gives me my rocket battery. Mm-hmm. Which I think is a mess. Yeah. Yeah. Rocket Maybe. batteries are only a. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Swift, uh, Flitter. James. Yep. Yep. What do you use? Okay, what do you use? The, the battery Salt can shoot outside of the covered arc, right? The battery can shoot any way anywhere it likes, yes. It's got 360-degree field of fire. All batteries have 360-degree field So I can shoot the vampire with my assault rockets. Yep. And then I can, if it survives, I can shoot it again, or I can use the battery no, you on the before. other ship. Yeah, you got to you got to declare, declare up. Yeah. So Just kill yeah. the vampire. <laughs> In more ways than one. Garlic. You yes. use garlic. Yeah, load, load, load the rocket back <laughs> with garlic. Garlic and silver and sun and UV light. All right, I'll shoot them both at the vampire. Okay. Which one first, the rockets or the laser battery? Rockets first. Right. 
Uh, it's a 50, 50, okay, 60, okay. Zero. Before I actually pull the trigger, <laughs> yes. if I pull the trigger on the lasers first and destroy the ship, do I have to use the... Uh... Rock, no, you don't have to use them, but you've got to target them. You, you, the targeting's okay. got to be locked in. Um, you just means you don't, you don't have to let me shoot you know. the laser first. <laughs> okay. Uh, 50, uh, 50, uh, 50, uh, 45% chance. And you hit. Location. Percentile dice for location. What's that? That's a 53. Lose See the entire their ADF. Eyes. Is it? Bugger. It I is. can't maneuver. I can't maneuver. Hang on, hang on, slow down. I'm going to note that down. I probably won't need to worry about it, but I do need to note it down. Well, you can't. You can still turn, but you know you can't. I can still turn, but yeah, but no, but I might. I'm, I might be destroyed here. Is what I'm going on. What color are say the eyes? Uh, I don't. Dark black. I dark black. Dark gray. Or I think from memory. Um, and so the assault rockets. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Send all dice. That's a whole so 30, hit. It's a whole hit. Um, so 2D 10 plus 4. This could wipe me out here. Probably does. Very nice. Boom. There's the vampire gone. Yay, me. The Osprey wants to fire with the debris. The Osprey wants to fire at the debris. Why? Well, we have nothing else to fire at, right? You can use your no, laser you battery on the, the devastator. devastator. One, two, three, four, five. It's only a twenty. It's only twenty-five percent chance less. Do you want to fire at the devastator? The devastator, then, please. All right, by all yeah, means. It's still, like what, a twenty-five percent hit chance? Yeah. And that's double damage. Oh, that's hey. cat. Oh, well, cat hits too. Cat hits too, so you both hit, right? So, Doc, your location is... Um, 72 power, lose all screens and ICMs. Screens and ICMs. So, no ICMs left. 20, whole hit. Mm -hmm. Hang on. ICM, and the whole nice hit dog. damage Cat. was 10 points. Nicely done. Nicely done, gentlemen. Anything else? That's everybody, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Right, just working, just mapping out how I'm going to do this. How you're planning your retreat? Ha! Never retreat, never surrender. Coming cause is more like it. Yeah, pretty much. They can pull a U-turn and be wherever he wants. Pretty much. You know, from so that low, about, low. Yeah. And that would be, he has to be at an even speed. Yep. So I'm going to have to drop that down to, or up, up either drop it to 10 or up it to 12. Um, it's up it to 12. So defensive fire. Um, at closest point of approach is probably where he is right now. Frigate? Yeah, I don't have any defensive fire. Okay. Uh, cat? That's a miss. That's a miss. Um, Laser battery. Yep. Then yeah, it's a hit. Location. That looks like hole. That's yep, the whole hit. So D ten. Another two points a hole. Um, who's next? Uh, who's who's Who's, who's who hasn't used who hasn't gone yet? The Osprey. Oh, the Osprey with the with the battery. Uh, that's a miss. 
unfortunately. All right, I'm going to split this fire up. Uh, I've got everything. I've got all my weapons. So, and you've taken a bit of damage, the frigate. So, um, let's see how we're going to do this. Two closest targets. So it's pretty much even, Stephen. This one. Oh, brownies yeah. right out of the oven. I'm taking five. Yep, go for it. Okay, so I've got laser cannon, laser battery, torpedoes, electron battery, and a rocket battery. You remember what a torpedo damage is? Uh, sure. 40, 10, and it's minus 20. 40, 10, minus 20. Uh, rocket battery. All right, so here's how here's how the fire is going to go. I'm just going to make a quick note for myself. Give me a sec. Because so the laser can the frigate's going to take the laser cannon and the laser battery. Okay. Yep. The um the wasp is going to take the torpedo. I reckon I could take you out if I hit you with that. R.I.P. Wasp. Yep. And the uh, rocket battery and electron batteries going against the Osprey. Remember, you can um, touch the torpedo. Yeah, <laughs> it's probably a good idea. It's the only weapon if it that hits you. Yeah. Um, unless it takes out one of your weapon systems, your toast. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, but considering it's minus 20 and the lower you go, the more likely you are to do damage and not do a system. Hold damage, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that's, that's how it's going. That's how it's all going to go in. Yeah, I'll be, I'll be dodging. You, <laughs> you're going to be dodging? As much as that means that I won't be able to make a U-turn on it, it's fine. Yeah, well. I won't be able to make a U-turn on it if I blow up either. <laughs> I think you can get lined up on it if you move correct, because you'll have one left. Uh, no, not quite. I can't. I can't work out how he could. No, I don't think he can. Not with an MR of four, you don't. Because I have to move. I He's got to move all four of them. Yeah. Uh, yeah. If you have an MR yeah. of four, you'll be faced. Yeah. Make that a way. loop. Make a circle. I don't know what your speed is. It might carry you through him, but you could make a loop. Yeah, you can you can get a head on. You can get a, you can get him in your assault rockets, but you can't actually get him in your. I don't think you can get him in a, on a head on a, a direct line. You can get him no. on the forward field though. Yeah. So yeah. Um. Sorry. Sorry. Frigate. For defensive fire? You've had defensive fire. No, it's for the yeah. getting shot at. Oh, oh yeah. You, it's for getting you got shot roll at. Laser yeah, cannon I'm, and laser battery. That's what I'm doing right now. Laser cannon. Um, that's a hit. Could be up to you, Babu. Uh, minus 10 on all your hits. Control system hit. Okay. Okay. Uh, the laser battery is also a hit. This guy took the minus 10 to all his hits, right? Uh, that was the other guy. I thought the other guy lost his laser cannon and his laser battery. He did. The other guy did lose his laser cannon. Combat control, or did you fix that? No, I fixed it. I've, that's why I take. That's why I've got. I'm taking notes, mate. Just give me a second, guys. Just starting to overheat. Had to take my sloppy joe off. Okay. Um, that's a steering loss, mate. An MR steering loss on the laser battery hit. Single point on the Leo. Okay, uh, I'm happy with those. <laughs> now, on the Wasp with the torpedo, this is my 
first or second torpedo. This is my second torpedo. So I have no more torpedoes left after this. It's better hit. <laughs> Would you have still missed if I hadn't dodged? No. <laughs> Okay, good dodge. <laughs> good dodge. Good dodge. Good dodge. <laughs> GG. 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 Okay. Uh, where are we? Oh, rocket, rocket battery on the Osprey. Uh, that's a hit. Uh oh. What is that? Double damage? Yep. 2d10. Yep. I thought a rocket battery did more than that. Mm -hmm. I'm, thinking, I'm thinking of something else. I must be thinking, I'm, it's nice. assault rockets. I'm thinking. Seeker missiles rockets. are 5d10. Mm, I know. The I advantage of rocket batteries is you can use them for defensive fire. Yeah, that's the difference. Eleven points of hull damage. Has two hit points left. Yeah, and an electron beam battery to go. That's a hit. Good news is, is this one's plus 10 on the damage. Yeah, yeah, that's good news in one regard. That's another hull hit. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. Got to roll a one. Yeah, I rolled a four. Yep. Boom. Boom. Okay. Oops. Well, Who just went bye-bye? Everybody. We all went bye-bye. <laughs> Um, you guys have got your movement, if you want it. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I have to slow the fuck down. Uh, but I, yeah. So what are you slowing down to? I am at speed 10. I need to slow down by 5 to hit 5. Yeah. I'll just do That's... my, I'll do my movement. Yep. Are you able to make a turn after you move your last uh, hex? If you just make a mm -hmm. right circle, you end up right at it, forward firing right at it. Who? The wasp. He just makes a tight right turn. He's dodging. He's got to move five hexes. He moves he five hexes. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, actually, he probably wants to move six. Yeah, he it must right be. back where he was. Well, no, he won't be. And aiming right at him. He only turned four. I know. Well, you can't, you can't end up back where you started. Because you have to move, you have to turn six for starters. Yeah, I I thought the best I could get. No, because he's he's not he's not ending up facing the same way. He's he would end up facing right down. Forward one turns right. Forward one turns right. He's on the flitter and he's facing three o'clock. Hang on. He started in that hex there. So move there and turn right. Yeah, it'll, that, and then move forward will put you and on the flitter. Move on top of the flitter, turn right. Yeah, it'll put and then move forward puts you there, turn right. It'll put you there. So you, Oh, okay. You're right. No, That's you, you take can't five do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take five five movement. Movement. I'm sorry. You can't, you can't do it. Yeah, so I, I <laughs> That's I, okay. But I can get to there. At speed five and with four turns, having to turn True. every time. Yep, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Which I believe is still the forward field. That's no bonus, but I can get both my attacks. Up. Um, no, it's not. No, How is forward that not... field is. That one's the first forward field on the offline. Hmm. 
Yeah. When I've drawn in purple there. Uh, it's garbage. Oh well, whatever. No, it's it's okay. Um, yeah, that's best, that's best you can do, mate. Is what you've done there, but it's not it's not feel the fire. It's not feel yeah. it's not feel forward. Okay. Um, and what about you, uh, Flitter? What are you uh, doing your speed? When I move into my last hex, am I allowed to make a turn as well? Yes. As long as it's under the... It's as long as it's only one hex. Yeah. Yeah. But your current speed's 11. Are you changing speed at all? Oh, I think I know what you're doing. Yeah. I believe you'll end up there facing facing down the down the horizontal line. Actually I was gonna end up right there with uh wasp. Oh yeah, you, 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 but you'll be facing down that line. You'll be facing down that line. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So you can do that. Just move him up there. And it's still at speed eleven. Still at 11. Yeah, okay. Uh, the frigate. Dan? Are you at MR2 now? He is. Sucks. Dan? Push the talk, Dan. Oh, sorry. I was trying to figure out my breakup chance. Oh. <laughs> so... Um, that's what I'm trying to figure out is, um, it, it sounds like, so I'm down, I'm 10 whole ports out of 40. So for every point that I use, that's 10%. Um, and then my engineer is level four, depending upon what his, what is his logic? Yes. His logic is it reduces that. Yeah. Well, standard logic standard logic for a level four engineer would be about it would be sixty. So that would be I reduce it by twenty five percent. So uh, mm -hmm. and we said it was ten per each. So I could do two points without breaking up. Yeah. Uh, three would be five percent. Okay. Yeah. But you've only got two points left, haven't you? Well, but my ADF MR too oh, as well. Yeah. So are you changing speed, are you? Um, yeah, I'm going to reduce my speed too and go in a straight line. What? what wait, what's his speed? Uh, his speed at the moment is 12. No, I'm going to, well... My speed sixteen. Oh. Yeah, very fast. So that's speed ten to that square, and I'm going to keep my speed at sixteen. So I'm going to use two movement and go that hey. way. All right, all right, all right. Well, hang on a sec. And would be six hexes Hang on. off the board. So that's right. Where you've put where you've put that green arrow. Yeah. That's where you're going. To, oh shit. That's where you're going to. Oh, for God's sake, Matthew. There we go. Where you put that head of the green arrow is what? Uh, it's 10 hexes or 16 hexes? That's 10 hexes. Right. So, so you need to be another... F okay, so... Three... 13... Okay. Okay, 
Right. <laughs> You're fleeing, obviously. Well, or no, maybe, or I maybe don't not. don't have the maneuverability Maneuver. to All engage. Right. Sorry, yes, that was my fault. Um, so, uh, Flitter and Wasp, where are you moving to? We've already moved. Yeah. Yeah, we moved. Did you? I did too. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, so that's you're actually in that in uh, in the same square as the flitter, uh, yeah. the wasp. Sorry. Wasp. Yeah. 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 Okay. So defensive fire. Um, let me let me have a go at you guys. Um, so uh, actually, has the flitter moved? Yeah, you have. Of course, you did. Um, don't mind me going nuts, my old age. Flitter, 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 flitter. Oh, son of a, there we go. So laser battery, have I still got my laser battery? Yeah, I have, it's my ICMs I've lost. So laser battery at the flitter, electron battery at the wasp. Leave the battery at the flitter. Miss, run at the wasp, miss. Two misses, uh, uh, offensive fire gentlemen. Uh, I assume you're not offensive firing, Daniel? Uh, no, I'm out of range. <laughs> no. Nope. Nope. Babu? Yes, I am. What? Which one first? Rockets or, ba or lasers? Uh, we'll do lasers and rockets. Okay. That's the only ship we have left, right? Only enemy ship? Yeah. Assuming you're not going to fire on your own people like the Sapphire agents you are. Oh, well, that's a hit with the that's a hit. Location. Uh, forty-five. That's a hull hit. Just barely. D10 damage. For four points. Uh, your assault rockets. Don't get to knock one off. Oh yeah, uh, no. That's, what are you rolling auto pistol for? I rolled the wrong thing. I, oh, because I uh, had my shift pressed. That's why. Well, it's, 60, a, it's, it's still a hit. 50 it's still then, a hit. It's yeah, still, it's still hit. a hit. So location. Nice. That's regular damage. That's regular hull hit damage. With the minus ten. Yeah, you got to yeah. be ten or below to get double. Gotcha. Yeah. Another six points of damage. Ten. Ah, sorry. Ten points of damage. All right, he's heavily damaged. Yeah, the table uh, goes from minus 20 to 120. Gotcha. Mm. All right, so... Um, the chances of me breaking up are so slim, it's not funny. The point where I'm not going to worry about it. But you probably also have like 25. Probably have 25 what? Four, four engineer. You probably have an engineer yeah, that gives saying. you 25. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Speed of 12. Okay. Uh, right, there we go. Did a loop, basically. Out and back. Uh, defensive fire. Uh, one hex range. That's a hit, cat. Double damage. Oh, double damage. D10 and we'll double it. Say so 16. Very nice. This could have been a mistake. This you could have might been a mistake. Break up. This could have been a mistake. <laughs> um, Babu. Anyone, any other any other defensive fire? Uh, Babu. Blow it up. Uh, I got a laser, right? Yeah. Oh, shit. Location? Number five. Whole hit. It's a whole hit. 
Damage? Roll, roll a 10. 7 is good enough. Very nice. I'm on 49 hull points. Oh, well, you, well. Your chances of breaking up are quite high now. Yeah, they are. They are 24 for every it's a point he uses. Mm -hmm. 24%. Yeah. Let me hit three. Uh, yeah, hang on. Yeah, but you hang on. Defensive fire become defensive fire, right? Comes Starts. after movement. After okay. movement. Okay? Even though you can take it at the start, even though you can take it at the closest point. So I don't have to ta I don't have to take maneuverability uh, break up rolls until next round. I've got to survive that long. Yep. Okay. So, oh, well, I've got one whole point left. I'm going to go all out here. I can't get the frigate, which was the primary objective. So, um, let me put in, I've got, have I got any rockets left? I do, don't I? I do have rockets left. I've got one rocket. I don't have any torpedoes. I can't use torpedoes. So laser battery, electron battery, and rocket battery. Um, laser battery on the wa on the wasp. Uh, the rocket battery, the electron battery at the flitter, and the rocket battery on the flitter. So, laser battery on the wasp. You do realize that I got two rockets left and I can slow down to one right what do you mean you've got, you. what do you mean you've got two rockets left I totally do oh shit I miscalculated I thought you're out nah, nah oh, I, got, bugger. I got two rockets left <laughs> and I've got speed five so I can stop right oh, in front shit. of you <laughs> yeah so you, I you might just want to get behind him anyways because you know uh, oh, shit I thought you were out of rockets. Why do you think I put myself there for? No, the Osprey was out of rockets. Oh, the crap. 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 All right. I'm going to try and kill you. Um, that's a miss, by the way. Okay, so let's try and kill the other ones. That's a miss. The rocket battery is my final shot. That's a hit. Uh, it's not a hull hit, unfortunately. It's a drive or steering. Hang on. Please don't say ADF. Then you don't want a 53. Because a 53 is when you lose all your ADF. Yeah, it is. No, it's a 43. 43. I rolled, yeah, I'm going to take hit. it. I know. I rolled a 53 and I thought, oh, and then I had to look over and look at the rocket batteries minus 10. So it's bugger. So it's a hull hit. So it's a D10 hull hit. Uh, five points. All right, cool. Five whole points. All right, do your maneuvering, guys. I get my defensive fire first, but do your maneuvering. I've got one rocket left. I'm going to be using it. <laughs> so basically, you only have to move one square forward. Is that right? Yeah, I mean, if I, if I was going to slow down to one and just yeah, go think of. Hang on. Okay. That's right. Ben, so well what are you get... saying? What are you saying down to, Ben? I'm just thinking. I'm going to slow okay. down to ten. Okay, you got to slow down to ten. Did you speed up or slow down, Leo? Dan? No, I am uh, two off. But I don't think you're going to last long enough to worry yeah, about it. Yeah. Well, we'll worry about it in a second. Yeah. Yeah, screw it. I'm going to slow down to one and be right in okay. front of you. Yeah, you mean there. Yeah, that's not right in front of me. I can't turn on you. I'm going to have to move forward before I can turn, remember? Oh, yeah, I know. I mean, right in front. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah. yeah you're right. Yeah, in front yeah, of yeah, me. yeah, 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 yeah. And I've got someone come up, coming up my ass. Yeah, and you might as well be point blank. Doesn't matter. All right. Who wants to kill me first? Well, you, you, get, you get to go fast. out in a last hurrah. You, get you might get lucky with your defensive fire. Yeah. Mm. All right. 
I'm gonna put everything. Rocket, I'm gonna put, how, hey. Uh, how many uh, rocket battery rockets do you start off with? Four. Nice. I've got one. I've got one left. This one. Yeah, I start with three. Uh, what am I doing? That's what I'm doing. No, I start with four, dude. Not a frigate. A destroyer yeah. does. No, frigates, yeah. all rocket battery, all rocket batteries come with uh, uh, four shots. Not a frigate. Yeah, even a frigate. Three. No, four. Is, I said you've got yeah, four. four. four ro- last time you had four. Yeah, it's four, mate. You haven't had a chance to use it. You haven't had a chance to use one. So it doesn't make, make a difference. But all, all rocket batteries come with four shots. Three reloads. That's where, that's where the three came from. Three reloads. That's where the confusion's arisen. My apologies for that confusion. All right, I've got a laser battery, an electron battery, and a rocket battery. Do I put them all on the one ship, or do I try and split them up? I'll split them up the same as last time with the rocket battery going on the wasp. Okay, so laser battery on the wasp. That's a hit. Uh, what's a 45? 45 is a hole. It's a hole hit with a laser battery. Barely. Yeah, okay. So the wasp takes a point. Nice. The rocket battery on the wasp. That's a hit. To the 70. 70? Uh, laser battery. That's laser battery. Laser battery. You Holes. lost your laser. You, At least oh. it wasn't the rockets. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wish it was. The rockets were the next. The, the, the rockets was. The rockets uh, the are a one. higher hit chance is what they are. Yeah, I know. And finally, the electron battery at the one come up my butt. That's a miss. Okay. Do your worst. All right. Well, the assault rockets, 60% chance. Let's do mm. it. Mm. Might be more than 60. No, it's only 60. It doesn't matter. Location, 58. Rocket battery. 48 is a drive. You lose one ADF. Is that all? I live uh, and breathe again. What the fuck? All right. ADF one. Babu. Oh, minus one. Babu. What was that with? Laser. Right. Ninety three. That's navigation. You lose maneuver near. Oh, you um, you have to turn, and you have one hole point. So I, know. Break I, know. <laughs> I know. 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 Good job, Babu. Uh, you got your salt rockets left hand in your badge? Yeah. No. You're out, are you? Or did I destroy it? Yeah, I'm out. Okay. Well, we might Which as well ca- do defensive fire then. Well, I get to move. I get to move. I get to move first. Thank you. Oh, yeah, we get to see if you destroy yourself. Yes. So, guess uh, what? Guess, guess, guess what? I'm not changing speed and I'm not moving. The, well, you have to turn because you got your nav hit. Oh, I have to turn. Shit. Yeah. That's you have to roll way. 1d10 before it yeah, moves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Left and right. Hang on. So, move, turn to the right. Roll for break up. No, I survived. Hey. Move. Two more turns. Turn to, to the turn to the turn to the left. Well, you get to roll your breakup chance all at once. Oh, I do too. In which case I survived. Well, how many points did you use? Two? Uh, three in the end. So that's 72. Yeah, I rolled a four. Ah. That's fine. You've got to survive two laser battery attacks. Uh, oh, no, I've got to survive two laser battery attacks. Uh, that's to the left again. So that's one, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You might be in range of the frigate's laser bat of the, the frigate. Yeah. How far did you say you're off the board, Dan? Two squares. Right oh, where I was. Hang on, right hang on, there. hang on, hang on. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So, uh, where where should you be? Right, the, uh, the one that I'm at. So there, because I moved the board up oh, four. I, okay. I moved the board up four, so that's where you should be. That's where everybody is. Okay. So defensive fire. Technically, the assault frigates are closest. So missed. Uh, hit. Location for the for baboos, defensive fire. Uh, 61. 61. That's a weapon hit. Laser cannon, laser battery. Ah, oh, shit. There goes my laser cannon. You're still alive. I thought I might be. I'm still alive. I'm still. Yeah, well, maybe not. What's the what's the frigate doing? What's the, the frigate doing to me? I don't have any defensive fire that you're in range have you? of. Nope. No laser battery. No, you took out my laser battery. Oh, I did too. Um, we got a repair round coming up too. Um, so yeah. I'm going to fire it. I'm going to fire at you because, well, why not? Uh, I don't have any rockets left. So it's just the two batteries I've got. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that's a penalty. Um, that's a miss. And that's a miss. Okay. You guys want to do some repair rolls? <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> All 60 points on the hull repair, please. Yeah, well, roll percent all dice. Yes, so D10 for how much hull you get back? Seven points back. You take any damage at all, Babu? No. Okay. Frigate, what are you doing? Um, I'm going to do... Two hulls for 40 each and laser battery for 30. Okay. So the, hull, the, the two hulls first. Yes. And yes. So 2d10 hull damage repaired. Oh. Oh, that, oh that's, that's sad. And that's the laser battery. Nope. Uh, no. No. <laughs> All right, what have I got? What do I want to bring back? Um, you can I use can't... four points safely now. Who can use four points? Oh, me, the yes, frigate. I can. No, no. Yeah. Um, Wait, um, no, I did put um, that um, You can use three. You did. I've got no rockets left. I've got no torpedoes left. I've... Uh, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to make three hull repair rolls. No. Yes. No. But I get back 10 hull points. <laughs> You're still out of control though. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Rip. 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 All right, guys, have your movement. All right, well, I'm speeding up to six. Speeding up to six? Yeah, I know. <laughs> and I guess I'll speed up to 11. And what's the speed of the destroyer? Uh, 16. Uh, 12, sorry. You really only uh, well. No, you yeah. can do what he likes. It's up to him. What are you doing? Where are you moving to, um, Dan? He did move. Uh, Dan, I said. Yeah. Sorry. Um, 
I can I can still shoot my laser battery seven hexes away, right? It's yeah, just, range of, it's range of nine, just, but you've got a you've got a thirty five minus thirty five percent. Yeah, fifteen percent hit chance. Fifteen percent chance of hitting. I might yeah. drop my speed by one to fifteen. Yeah. I don't know about you, but firing offensively at the end of the movement is a is a better tactical game, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it was too easy the first one, so I, yeah. I like this way better. Um, it makes a lot more sense for more maneuverable craft like you know assault scouts that you just get uh, on their tail to harass them. Yeah, yeah, which is pretty much you know what you guys have been it's doing. What you to would me. do in a fight, yeah. Mm. Okay, oh, you and know where you are. Five more hexes off. Okay, can you actually turn that far? Oh, you, you can. All right. Well, um, my defensive fire. I'm going to put everything everything I've got, which is the two batteries, on the uh, on the flitter. So yeah, that's what I figured. Laser battery first. Miss. Electron battery Miss. second. Miss. Damn it. Take your shots, boys. So this is like a fifteen percent hit chance. Babu, Babu hits. hits and you yes. hit. Oh. <laughs> Sixty-four is weapon hit. Uh, photon beam. I don't have electron a photon beam. beam. Laser that battery. I do have. Hang on, I've lost an electron beam. Damn it! What's a forty-five? Uh, whole uh, hit. Forty-five whole hit. Oh god! There goes most of my hull again. Points. And I've got two points of hull. Nice. Is that everybody? Enjoy that turning. Yeah, yeah. Don't thanks, worry, guys. Right? He only has a laser battery left, <laughs> and he's turning out of control. And two whole points. It's yeah, like that. Up. It's like that scene in The Simpsons. No, no, stop! It's dead already. <laughs> two. Sixty-nine percent chance to see what happens. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Will put me. Whoops. There. Defensive fire. One, uh, one hex for the laser battery and two for you, Ben. If you're going to fire at me, which you're assuming you are, bastards got me both locations, gentlemen. 63, 63. that's another damage. He's dead. And you're dead. Yeah. Well done. Before that, you lost your last laser battery, though. Yeah, yeah, for you. <laughs> well done, gentlemen. Wow, that was hectic, but pity we're all dead. That's the sad moment. Oh, yeah, that's a sad moment. Well, um, there's there are rules if you wish. Yeah, well, hang on a sec. Um, I can. Uh... That's don't worry about. It. I've got it here. Um, what am I doing? Let me get rid of these. Now let me get rid of all of it. Make it a bit easier, a bit quicker. Oh, no, it won't. Um. Hang on a sec. Is everybody still online? Yep. Yep. Yeah. We're yeah. In. Yeah. Yeah. No, I just wanted to make sure uh, people hadn't. We've gone way past our time. That's all. Um, I just want to make sure everybody was um, still here. They hadn't dropped off yet. I'm still here. That's good. Um, look. Um, I. Oh, what am I doing? Get rid of this. Sorry, just tie, I'm just tidying up some stuff. Don't say that. Get rid of it. This game's been going now for three years. Three and a bit years. Yeah, it's that, closer to four, isn't it? Something, it's closer to four. 
Um, we've had a good run. Um, I'm not set up for you guys doing up new characters per se. Um, I think, and I'm I'm open to discussion. It's not this is not this is not a decree. This is just a just a. I think we might it might be a good place to wrap up at this point. Death is always How, good to wrap things up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is. Um, what are, what are you, what are people's thoughts? I think I personally would be fine with that. I mean, it'd be a bummer. I have fun doing this, but oh, we all do. But I said, you know, yeah, yeah, we we don't play as often I... as we did. We, you know, when we first started because of various things. You're about to say something. Um... Oh, I just say I could go either way. It, I, I've, I enjoy this, but yeah, you know, it's been a long, long haul. Yeah. Well, I said it's a long campaign. Uh, Doc, uh, J, uh, Paul, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> what are you? What are your thoughts? Um, I took on this character as a chance to try to play something without any violence, so a, a change for me would be probably a little welcome, actually. Okay. Uh, Cerise? Uh, Daniel? Yeah, I think it's probably about time. I, you know, a few weeks ago, I would have definitely said yes. Um, I'm right, really well, enjoying right now, but, you know, we can, we can get together another game. Yeah, all right. Well, in that case... Um, Thank you, everybody. Just stay on the line, guys. Thanks, everybody, for watching over the last 40 odd episodes. Um, for those who have been watching on YouTube, um, uh, thanks everyone for playing. I've I've enjoyed putting this on, although as I said, it's it's we've been going quite a while now, and we're getting to that point, so that's all right. Um, thanks everyone for playing. I listen. I hope people enjoyed the campaign overall. Um, as I said, I enjoyed. It. I hope everybody else did. Yes. Um, yeah. Well. Yeah. Well, uh, thanks everybody for watching. If you can roll those credits, thanks um, Ryan, and kill our our mutes, our voices. That'd be great. Um, thanks everyone. Um, we'll organise something sometime in the future and let people know on the YouTube channel what we're doing, um, and go from there. So thanks everyone for watching. We'll see you everybody whenever we see everybody next. Yep. See you then. Right. Yeah. Bye. Well, that's it for this session. We hope you've enjoyed the game as much as we did. We'd like to thank Smiteworks, Sirenscape and Twitch, and of course, all the fantastic people involved with the Star Frontiers RPG over the years. I'm Dulux Oz, and on behalf of the entire gaming group, we'd like to say thanks for watching. We'll see you all next time. Until then, may your God go with you.